stacked. On myself. Sean! Will you shit on my merch? Go G Uni. Put your goddamn name in the goddamn recent Bobby Shroom. You know what? I just need to give a fair warning. I'm I'm angry. I'm angry and it's I'm we're not going to have fun. And I'm angry. Let's go, Wubby. Which means, okay? Which means, yeah, I know. I'm not hangy. Ribbit. I know. No fun zone today. I'm just giving you the fair warning. What's wrong, little pup? What the fuck? Ban that person. Do you need tits on the subreddit? No, God, no, stop! Is there a is there a frog in here? Respectfully, 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 with peace and love. so hard i love it i'm not even gonna show the photo again it's just a bang i'm just playing this as a banger now it's so good you disagree So that comes the hill, I'm the Kahol Munjamil, 
Bro, <laughs> this is nearly a five-minute song. Also, this is just worth showing you guys. This is the um, this is the YouTube uh, background. <laughs> <laughs> this is what's on my monitor, dude. That's good. That's good. See, that that seems more offensive. Are you going to talk about Valve banning CSGO skin traders? I don't know that story. I, I will, I'm not avoiding it. I don't know what you're talking about, but you can link something and I'll talk about it. Is it interesting? I know nothing about it. Oh, chat, hello! Listen, hello! Good afternoon! Happy Wednesday! Dark HD Wubby here because my camera's still not fixed and I'm just cheap and I don't want to buy another multi-thousand dollar camera. Hello! Dark Wubby! Not tan Wubby. Bad mood Wubby. You know, you get two halves, you get two sides of the same coin. Play Pump It Up. It's gonna be Snee Snaw! Wubby seven, Wubby Snee Wubby Wubby five seven. subs! Wow. Business not a booming. But we do appreciate it, Snee Snaw. Thank you. Uh, uh, yep, I don't even know if that's the real one, but who cares? Uh, uh, on Sunday, you got to see me in a great mood. I was in my own. I, was, I had just played Twilight Imperium, okay? I was opening magic cards. Wubby couldn't be happier. Here I am on a Wednesday. I just bit my tongue really hard. See, today's a bad day. It's not gonna be a good day today. We have great content, don't get me wrong. There's good shit a-brewing, but and Alex isn't, isn't gonna be in this room, so I don't have a time frame. so I get a yap. And I get a yap today without anybody trying to stop me. Alex was gonna join us on stream today, but she is very ill. When you get a little bit older in age, you get sick more often. Uh, I believe she also fell and her or her hip turned to dust in that moment. Um, so she, so you motherfucker, I'm just saying the truth, Alex. So we're doing the regularly scheduled content without her today, but that now allows me to yap it up! She said Discord, uh-oh. Uh-oh, oh, she's calling me, oh God. Hey. Hey. <laughs> oh, you're gonna call with the old fake voice, huh? Just tell him you're in labor, come on. <laughs> Bro, you're such an asshole. <laughs> fake cough, anyone think that's a real cough, you're fucking stupid. Go ahead, Alex, what do you gotta say? Do you just call to give a fake voice? Yeah, <clears throat> I just called just to say fuck you. You sound gross. Yeah, I feel gross. <clears throat> yeah, I bet. I bet you look gross too. Like I bet it's everything. Bro, actually, legit. Yeah. 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 <coughs> you want to show up, chat what you look like? Fuck no. Oh. <laughs> Ew, God. Can you cover your? I feel like we're getting sick hearing you. Oh my God, we get it. You didn't want to do stream today, Jesus. We get it. Okay. Man. Oh, someone in chat said, "Love you, Big Al." How's that make you feel? I still feel like shit, so... Okay, well, you sound like shit, and just a reminder, <laughs> you probably look like shit, so... Thanks, thanks. Yeah. <laughs> Today is right. a fucking shitty day, fuck you. <laughs> is it worse than yesterday now? <laughs> it's equal. Uh, maybe if you Not better. spent more time recovering and less time complaining. <laughs> I'm totally <laughs> kidding. No, give it up for Alex. You know what? Let's give it up for Alex, huh? For, you know... <laughs> You know, women have had it too hard for too long, you know? All right. Is, you just called to say you were sick? Is that why? Yeah, because yeah. you said I fell and broke my hip because I'm old. <laughs> I don't know. I don't keep track of all your ailments. Listen, I don't I don't have to. That'd be a full time job. <laughs> I'm funny. Dude, I'm yeah. funny. All right. Are you, having, are you having a better day now? Yeah. I'm actually... <laughs> you know what? You're welcome. You're welcome. I'm doing better. It's Have been a, a huge stream. turnaround. Yeah. I'm actually doing okay. great now. Thank you okay. for you know what? Thank you for calling, Alex. You're welcome. All right, bye bye. <laughs> okay. okay. All right. Why did? By the way, she cleared our DMs with a photo of a baby. Am I expected to believe she's not in labor right now? I'm not even lying. I don't know whose baby this is, so I'm not gonna show until she gives me permission. She clicked because when you're DMing someone, we she's saying, "Lol, whose baby is this?" Are you sure you're not in labor? Because this thing looks newborn. She's typing. Hold on. I'll get ready to show you guys this. Hold on. Guys, we have so much to talk about today, and we have content. It's a double feature. I love that a double feature for me is a stream for most. But you know what? That's not why you give me money. You give me money because we create this weird environment where you feel obligated to. OMG, I can't type. 
Oh, is okay. Can I show this photo, Alex? She has baby fever. The baby has fever. I tried donating media share twice, Wubby. Is it something on my end? Stone Cold Jeebus. Okay, today is not media share. Can today is not you media you share, Stone voice. Cold Jeebus. Where are you? And I'm so sorry. I cannot Thank sleep. You. I Almost cannot well dream you. tonight. I, I need somebody. And, and always. Uh, if you're meaning you just like donated a video, I could pu pull it up if you want me to. Impega, thank you for the 10. What are all these? When did all these subs come in? Was I distracted? Artemay, thank you for the five. Sweet Leaf Llama, Mama, thank you. Uh, uh, Nugget Lee! Blubbers. Y'all really didn't ever come for me for like really racistly butchering that Indonesian lady's name, did you? I just got away with calling her Nugget. Are we? Do I should I even bring that up? Who gives a shit? What is she gonna do? All right. Um, Grandfather. Uh, I, I see a, a video donated here. Do you want me to play it? Oh, there it is. Okay, wait, here it is. This is every, okay. Here's the problem though, buddy. We're pausing everything to watch this, which means chat's gonna be extra critical. This person donated DJ Be Light, Tupac, Tup, Tupac, Tupac, whew. Yeah, I, I like rap. I'm a bit of a rapper myself. Tupac, yeah, I've been listening to that Tupac guy. All right. Um. This is what he donated. You guys ready? All I, living life is a thug till I die, die. Living life is a box player till I get high. Living life is a thug. How does it? So how does it? How, all eyes on me. How, okay, how does it go? I love this song actually. Man, I wish that I could rap every lyric along with Tupac. I know somewhere out there he's wanting me to rap along with him, but society's got us down. You know what I'm saying? All eyes on me. some laughs love you goblin man well hey this one goes out to hey rip grandma you know this one goes out to grandma this remix is good dance to it You know grandma was a Pac fan. You know she was. Mid, have some respect, bro. All right, that's all you paid for. <laughs> that's all grandma gets. Uh, what are we talking about? We have so much to talk about. I should, should I just get the mad thing out of the way? Because I feel like I'm going to bait it for too long. Oh, here's the baby, by the way, that Alex linked me. Yeah, she said it's okay to share. Here's that baby. This is what my DMs were cleared with with no explanation. Dude, I don't give a fuck. Babies are gross. You hear me? Babies are fucking gross. See, I'm, I'm mad. I'm mad. I'm mad and I shouldn't be taken out on newborns. Okay, but I am mad. I'm mad. Ba Dude, look it. Look, I can look. Why are you? Why are you moist in areas? Why? You stare at a baby for long enough, you're going to start to notice imperfections. <laughs> I should stop talking. No, but on God, you stare at a baby for long enough and you start to be like, damn, he got a crusty mouth. Why there's shit in his nose? What's that on his eyes? Throw it away. Um, you give, someone gifted someone a tier two? No, 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 no. They be leaking. Babies be leaking, bro. Are you not wet in the process? Wait, I read that wrong. Are you? Wow, hold on. Really butchered that. Are you not wet in wrong places too? Wow, read that very wrong. <laughs> so quick, give me a ukulele. I need to apologize. <laughs> uh, okay. All right. Um, all right, let's just talk about what I'm mad about. Let's get this out of the way. And I want you guys to know I've grown as a man. Okay? I've grown as a man. Because I was going to make this a tweet, but instead I'm going to keep it in my community because I'm not, I don't need to bitch to the, you know, an old wubby, this would have been a video because that's how petty I am. I'm very petty, but now new wubby will just bitch on stream for a few minutes and we'll call it even. Okay. This is simple. All right. So I haven't, nobody knows this. I have not told this to anyone, but I recently, uh, got into a, got a ban. I am banned somewhere right now. Um, and we're going to talk about that. So I woke up a few days ago, a few days ago, I woke up and I went to check my, uh, subreddit. 
I went to check my subreddit. And on my home screen of Reddit on my computer, you have been banned from Reddit for seven days. Not the Lego store, guys. Not the Lego store. But I was banned from Reddit, not my subreddit. I was banned from the platform of Reddit. You know what? I'm going to talk about this for long enough that I'm just going to tweet it. I can't help myself. I am so mad. Hold on. I am banned from Reddit. For, and I want to be clear here. People, I've been banned from subreddits. I'm sure I'm banned from many subreddits. I don't know. But I have been banned from Reddit. Suspended for seven days. And I went, what the fuck? What did I don't what do I use Reddit for? I jerk off and I and I mod my subreddit. That's all I use Reddit for. I use Reddit spank bank and to to moderate my own subreddit. That is all I use Reddit for. So I'm like, what the fuck did I get set? And also, anyone who doesn't know, seven days is is a long ban. Especially I use my Reddit all, like every day I have it up somewhere to moderate my own Reddit. I use Reddit. It's what you get for dissing grandma. Appreciate the love. I didn't dis fuck your grandma. Anyway, uh, so yeah, seven days is a pretty long, so it's like, what did I do? My longest on Reddit was three days, right? So you might be asking yourself, what did you do, Wubby? And I'm sitting there when I saw this message and I went, what the fuck did I do? I have, I have no clue. I don't comment anything. I don't say anything. I don't, I don't do anything crazy at all. I, there's no hate. There's no nothing. So I get this email. I'm going to go through this right now. You were uh, violated or you violated uh, harassment and a uh, rule violation, banned for harassment. So I'm like, huh? Who the f I don't, what do I use Reddit for? I interact with my community and I, I, the most recent thing I did on Reddit right before my ban, like the day before I got banned, I uh, sent a message to a mini painter to ask for commission. I wanted to commission them, uh, which, by the way, this really fucking uh, pissed me off. Uh, you said retard, didn't you? No, you guys are gonna, you guys are going to be as furious as I am when you found out when you find out why I got banned. You're going to be as it is going to shock you, and my goal of this is to scare you because this shit is. I, I'm I'm actually kind of mind melted, and it's why I'm so angry. They didn't let me say the n word. No, I'm kidding. You'll see. So I got banned for harassment and I went, harassment, what do I use Reddit for? Browsing like everybody else does. And the only times I interact are like reaching out to people in my community or like just the other day I reach out to someone for a commission. Never do I act as like edgy wubby when I'm reaching out to somebody else. And if I ever am in character, I'm talking to a fan or a viewer, right? Yes, yeah, CS skins, all kinds of things, right? So uh, banned for harassment, I'm like, what? So I click view the message, it links me to the message that I'm actually banned for. So first, here's on Reddit them telling me I got banned. Um, so it's a uh, rule violation, temporarily banned for harassment. You've been banned for seven days by the Reddit admin team. So they're saying, so they're saying here that a human being looked this over. So do ever that human beings, congrats on the lobotomy. Okay, you're doing a great job. All right, you're doing fantastic work there behind that desk with that stick up your ass. Best, what I'm saying to you right now is 10 times worse than what I got banned for. And if you notice, I'm still live on Twitch. Honest to God, I, it's shocking to me that you can even operate a keyboard with how brain dead this is. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, show this ban to anyone. Show this ban to anyone and try to justify it. I beg you, I beg you. And I even said this, if they offered me a warning or a two-day ban or even a three-day ban, or how about an appeals process? How about something on here that shows me I can appeal this, right? Any of those things, I probably wouldn't have brought it to stream. But none of those are on the table. None of those. Okay, hold on. Ready? So, uh, Reddit is a place for blah, blah, blah. Okay, yada, yada, everything. And uh, I, I apparently harass somebody. I apparently harass somebody. So, I click. It links to the message I sent. You guys are not ready for this. You ready? Somebody, the day after my Magic the Gathering stream... Uh, if you guys recall, I was hunting a specific card, one of the elvish, dwarven, or human rings. I was hunting those above all else. Somebody on my subreddit pulled one of those, uh, and they were excited. If you go to this link, you'll be able to find it here in a second. Uh, if you go to this link, uh, you'll see that they made a post about it, and the as the subreddit does, people were making fun of me. They were flashing it in my, flashing it in my face, and that's all fine, by the way. I... I 
this is the community I've built. And not only that, it's kind of how Reddit is. It's fun. We're all in a community together. We're having fun. They're messing with me. I mess with them. So I, after that, I reached out to the person who pulled it directly. And I sent him a message kind of fucking with him, rubbing elbows like, ah, I sent this. You guys ready? This is the message I got a seven day, non appealable, non warning ban for. You ready? You're a bastard man for that pull. Seven day Reddit ban for a private man. This is what's really fucked up. This was a private message. Are the, is Reddit looking through messages? Okay, there's two possibilities here, right? I went through this guy's profile because my first thought was, did this guy report me? So I went to his profile. This guy's in the community, not like adjacent. He was making memes on the subreddit. He was commenting. He definitely watches and he likes to, he reported you. Okay, so then here's the thing, right? Here's, there's two issues here. We, we don't know if he reported me. I'm going to give this guy an opportunity to get on a call with me and talk to me because I would love to hear his side of the story. I don't think he reported me. Yeah, he's in chat right now. I did not report him. Dude, I believe you. I believe you. I was looking at your, your history. You're a part of the community. He 100%, he's saying he didn't. They don't check messages. Get on a call. Get on a call. Let's see. Prove it. Go. Th let's prove it. Get on a call. So hold on. Before everybody freaks out, before everybody freaks out, let's talk about the possibilities here. Possibility, both are bad. Neither are good. Okay, possibility one, this guy reported me. So th that means that this is a bannable offense on Reddit and that anyone in my community can get anyone banned for this. Have you guys, has Reddit been on Reddit? I'm, I'm gonna ask that one more time if that didn't land properly. Has Reddit been on Reddit? It, let's say this guy reported me. Okay, if I'm doing something wrong and I'm, if, I, if I'm harassing you, then you should report me. That's totally fair. Is Reddit taking a stand that this is harassment now? I'm sorry, if, if this guy really did report me, I would hope Reddit would have the decency to hit me up and go, hey, we got a report, here's a warning. And then I could respond, oh, my mistake, I was being chummy with this person. If it came off that way, I'll make sure to let them know I can apologize. And honest, honestly, I wanna keep it a buck too. If this person reported me, I'm, I'm gonna ban you from the community. You're not made for this community. If this is harassment to you, I don't think Reddit is safe for you. I don't think YouTube is safe for you. I don't think Twitter is safe for you. I'm gonna take a step further. I don't think the internet is safe for you because this was chummy. This was you made a post shoving a card in my face and I wanted to be honest with you if I'm to be very transparent, this was my way of opening a private conversation to see if I could possibly buy it off of you. I wanted to start by being chummy. Ah, you're, you're a son of a bitch for pulling that card. Yeah, there, the, how is this? What is, where is the, Reddit, could you please show me where the harassment is here? This was sent to a fan who posted on my subreddit about a card that I was trying to pull that they pulled. We can't, so, okay, so here's option one. Here's option one. This guy reported it. That means that you guys can get anyone banned on Reddit for nothing. Kind of a scary thought. I'd be very careful on Reddit, both in private DMs and public. It looks like you can get banned for anything. That's option one. Option two. Option two, this is the even worst option. And this is the one I think it is. Is Reddit just scanning our DM message, our private messages oh, son, and making- Oh, bastard son for that. Is, is Reddit scanning our messages and, okay, fine, I'm using their platform, but then are they making snap call judgments without any sort of conversation, banning people for seven days? Now, let me be clear. If you're just a browser, of Reddit, a seven day ban might not matter. You're gonna probably do a ban evasion, make a secondary account and continue to browse Reddit. I am a moderator of my subreddit for my community that has activity every, this matters to me. I already had to have a conversation with TT about this to find a solution, which we did, but it's all AI regulated. Okay, but then here's the thing. Here's my point, you ready? Let's go back to point one. If it's all AI regulated, then here's what you need, Reddit. And I can't believe I need to hold your hand for this because you guys are too brain dead for this. If it's all AI regulated, I have two suggestions. Please don't say by a Reddit admin team. That does not imply AI. And the second suggestion right here, right under here. If you believe this ban was done incorrectly, by the way, I'm not reading this. You should fucking add this, you morons. If this ban was done incorrectly, please submit an appeal here. I would have clicked that, I wouldn't have said anything to my stream, and I would have moved on with my life. Accidental bans happen all the time, I get it. So that's what I would have fucking done.
This is wild. Dude, it is fucking wild. I got banned from Reddit for seven days for messaging my fan in jest, in jest, in fucking jest over a card he pulled in my community. I cannot believe this, dude. I'm so, I was at my desk. I was so fucking, because I knew if I got this guy involved too, this guy would be like, what? You got banned? And if he wasn't, let's say this guy's super malicious. Reddit, that's a lot of power you're giving to any user of your platform. I mean, this is AIDS. The dude who, can I get a call? Yes, dude, please reach out to Peanut. Reach out to Peanut. We'll get you on a Discord call. I would love to hear what you have to say. I don't think you reported this. I don't. I went through your post history. You seem like a fan. You just seem like a dude that likes watching. And even in your post that I was commenting on, you were having fun taking jab. You seem like, okay, now I see people posting, you can appeal. So today I did research and I found, by the way, through no help of Reddit, I was able to find you can submit an appeal. And I want it to be known, you have to jump through hoops. It is not here to click. I did not, I, when I got this message originally, I went, oh, I can't appeal, great. I had to first Google it, okay? And not to mention through my research, apparently from what I've seen from other people, Appeals don't do anything. They don't check appeals as far as I'm aware. They don't even look at them. That's a, that's a guess. That's what I've seen from other user experiences. They don't check them at all. And not to mention, here's the funniest part about the appeal. The appeal explanation section has a character limit. And it was, a, from my experience today, it was about three sentences. And you know what that means, right? I got about halfway through the explanation before I'm like, oh, my keys aren't typing anymore. So then I had to word it like fucking Kevin Malone. I'm like, I, I couldn't even, I'm sitting here like, you won't even let me explain why this ban isn't worthy in your, it's like, in a few words, please explain. Motherfucker, this is nuanced. Sorry if that word might go over your head, Reddit team, okay? But this is nuanced. And you know what's crazy? You know what's crazy? This is what I'm banned for right here. This is what I'm banned for. Please, and I put this in my message to them. I said, what I'm banned for is something that I see commonly Every day on the front page of Reddit, this is the culture that Reddit, this is a joke. This is a lighthearted thing I sent to a fan. Go to the front page of Reddit right now. There is more hate and harassment in the comment section of every single post daily. I mean, this is just, oh, I'm lit. This is literally PG. This is, guys, even if I sent this to a complete stranger, I would make the argument that this is kind of ridiculous for a ban. But it wasn't! This was sent to a fan on my subreddit who was talking to me through a post! Oh my god! Fuck it! Uh, dude, I also, I also found out, this, this reminded me of something. Someone on my subreddit, we didn't really talk about it because like, what do you do? Someone on my subreddit was permabanned from the platform for using the word retard in a comment on my subreddit. I, I know Reddit has rules in general, but the policing of, pri of subreddits at this point, this is officially way too fucking far. You're gonna go through my DMs with somebody and then you're gonna make the call if it's inappropriate? Why don't we make the call? This is a DM. This is not public. This was not commented. This was a DM I sent privately to another guy. You're gonna make the call without asking either of us? I mean, Booty just said, I made it to our all with a post titled retard. Yeah, I know. There's no consistency. I mean, this shit is, if this doesn't make you mad, let me explain why it should. Hey chat, if you ever use the platform of Reddit, make sure to know anything you say might be scanned by an AI and then approved by a Reddit team, even if it's a private message. Nobody has to report it. Just know they can determine off of nothing if you're gonna be banned or not. That is, you're saying, yeah, no shit. I have been on the internet since I was a child. I have never in my life heard of your DMs being reviewed when nobody reports it, right? If I go on Twitter right now, right, and I just start harassing some fucking guy in DMs, kill yourself, da da da, da. yeah, I'm gonna get banned, right? But if me and Peanut go on Twitter and we're just shit talking each other privately in DMs, neither one of us are gonna get banned. But wh why would we? We're two homies shit talking in DMs. That doesn't make any sense. This is not even shit talk. This is nothing. This is fucking nothing, dude. This is nothing, bro. No way he didn't report you. Well, we're gonna get him on a call right the fuck now. And I need to cool off before I get him on this call. 
Uh, waiting for homeboy to message me. Okay, added him. Here we go. Let's get on a call, and I'm gonna grill him. But I need to calm down. I need to calm down. I need to calm down. <clears throat> Did he reply to you? Hey, what's up, man? Hey, what's up? What's up, Judas? Sorry, I'm mad, but I need you to. I need, let's. Okay, from the top. What's your name? And what's your address? Just kidding. What's your name? Uh, I go by Sykes on. Uh... Okay, so uh, you made a post on the subreddit. Do you want to tell us about that post? Yeah, so me and my husband, we both bought uh, a pack, one pack, just one pack, and so we you decided really to- You really are a bastard! Okay. You really- one pack, dude? It was one pack, and you know, we love uh, we love Lord of the Rings, we love the art, we're not really so much magic uh, mm -hmm. people, but, you know, when we pulled that, we didn't even really know what we had until we watched oh, your stream. Oh my god. Okay, so my stream is what caused you to make the post, ultimately? Yes. Okay. And again, like, uh, I saw that you had the, the cards on the bottom. Granted, it's not, uh, was it, it's not serialized, but right. I still thought it was a pretty good pull. Right. It, it, it's an excellent pull. So, uh, I sent you a DM. First off, you see the DM on screen. Does the, do you, jet, like, be honest with me. Do you, I mean, this is a message between you and I and no one else. Yep. They are, I'm banned for harassment. Do, did this make you feel harassed, like, genuinely? God knows. I have, when this whole thing came up, it all, it felt kind of surreal because I didn't do shit. It's that meme of, I didn't do fucking shit. So you're going on, so you, on record right now, because I'll, I'll, we can escalate this. On record, on my stream, on recording, are you uh, saying you did not report that message? No, I did not report anything. I don't even think I know how to report on Reddit. I just thought it was great that you messaged me. So you saw the message? Yes. So you, and and did you so I after I sent it I got banned. Did you reply? Did you say anything back to me or no? Nope. I wasn't <laughs> sure if you were if you wanted to like continue the conversation because oh, you, you just oh, kind of left fair, it like fair. You know, no fair. Fair. Closed That's ended. Fair. That's fair. I did just call you a bastard man and then dip. That's fair. <laughs> but just to be very clear, yeah, you you big time me actually. You big time me. You th I'm not going to respond to him. Hey, with, all, with uh, all that being said, the card is still, uh, you know, available. So. Well, in, in, in about five days, we can uh, have a conversation about it on Reddit. But be careful. You could be banned at any time. So uh, I I'm believe a, I just you. got my 37 months. Uh, that wouldn't be fair. To You're me. a 30. Dude, of course you wouldn't think this harassed me. You're a 37. Okay. So that means, it, and I, I trust you. Chat seems to trust you too. That means that Reddit read our DMs privately and ban me off of nothing and you are, are you really saying, surprised can i be on a little yeah <laughs> i mean if there are probably flag words right if i'm saying like i don't even want to get into it but there's like probably slurs that flag and 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 definitely like telling someone to kill themselves or something like that would probably flag it but it is is bastard a flaggable word i like, have really? no idea it, well, it, Again, this all came as a surprise to me. Yeah. Oh, I'm glad you cleared your name because I saw people already getting mad. But I, oh, I yeah. saw your post history, and I, I didn't think you were someone who would report me after. No. You seem to be a part of the community. All right. Well, For sure. Um, you know, I don't know how, how to get in the six month server, but that's a whole nother can of beans. Do you need to get in the six month server? Someday. Message TT. Message TT. We got you. All right. Okay. Um. Well, thank you. Do you have anything else you want to say? I'm gonna let you go. No. Bye. That was an odd way to end that. I'm not even gonna lie. That was odd. Um, <clears throat> yeah. So okay. Now, if I wasn't uh, fuming before, man, I'm okay. So that man has on record set. So now Reddit. I I think it's time for a tweet. I think it's time for a tweet because now now that you cannot. So I was nervous today by bringing all this out, I was nervous that somebody could, somebody in chat, because I have haters who watch, who will always give me the worst, like the opposite of benefit of the doubt. They view me in the worst light. They are so uncharitable, right? And I was ready for people on the subreddit to go, well, what we did use the word bastard. And maybe that made someone very uncomfortable, which I don't subscribe to. I will not humor that argument, but I was nervous people were still gonna try that argument. Now, I want it to be clear, that argument is dead on arrival. The man I sent the message to has on it in video confirmed without a shadow of a doubt. He did not feel harassed. He was excited by the DM. He, there was nothing by it that caused any issue and Reddit has heavily overstepped here. I'm sorry, but this, this is you. 
I, I'm trying. See, the, I'm nervous to use even harsh language because I feel they are going to find any way to justify perma banning me at this point. I want to call them names. I want to make fun of this absolute blunder on their part. But I'm nervous if I say, oh, you're acting regarded. They're going to make, nope, you're banned from Reddit forever. Perma ban, perma ban. I mean, it's, uh, it's frustrating. It's all speculation. Don't take it too far in a tweet. What's the spe what am I speculating on? No, honestly, no, 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 no. You do it in chat. What am I, what am I speculating on? Where is the speculation? I was, Reddit told me why I got banned. This link links to this message. This message was what I sent to that guy. I just got on a call with that guy. What am I speculating on? He could be lying. He could be lying about it. Okay, but that's what's great. If I get Reddit to respond and go, no, that dude reported it, then great. Now we have a new target. <laughs> I mean, if that dude is li also, I'm going to be honest, that big gay bear man does not, he's like, I don't even think I know how to report. That sounded really fucking genuine to me. If he's lying, great, great. It's target acquired. I don't think he's lying. I really don't. And if Reddit would respond like, hey, that dude reported it. Then now we got a really juicy story on our hands, right? <sighs> what if this is punishment for the going private protest? I, okay, should I put out this tweet? You know what? Let's screen it first. You guys can screen what I said first because I have it typed up here. I'm so... Wait, did I, did I exit off? No, I didn't. All right. <clears throat> All right, here's the tweet I have typed up. I would need signal boost from chat though. Chat, we'd have to send this to the fucking stratosphere. Uh, I mean, at the end of the day, Reddit will probably do nothing and they'll let the seven days pass. But I guess what's good is I can, I can, and I want everybody to just keep this in mind and remember this forever. Do be careful what you do on Reddit. They are in there, dude. They do not give a fuck. <clears throat> Send the tweet. All right. I wrote this seven day Reddit ban for bantering with my own community about magic cards. No clear option to explain or appeal. As if the platform wasn't dog shit enough, this is some clown behavior with three clown emojis. Three! I said, pick, there's pictures, so pick two is the message I sent a fan after he pulled a card I was hunting on stream. <sighs> Make it four, I'm out of characters. <laughs> I'm out of, hey, I'm out of characters. <clears throat> Include that he did not report, that's good, actually that's good, that's good, that's good, How, I'm out of characters, fuck. I'll put a one of two. I'll put a one of two. Should I put a one of two? And then and then the two of two is a reply. <clears throat> oh, wait, I can take out the word message and use the word DM. Okay. Pick two. Ooh, you guys are smart. You guys are smart. So a one of two. Uh type it like XQC to shorten the length. <laughs> uh pick two is the DM I sent to a fan after he pulled the card. Uh uh uh. For pro, oh I got, oh God, I gotta, oh I gotta be, uh, I gotta, uh, pay the eight dollars for what? Oh, I get more if I pay eight dollars. Post the clip of him on stream. Oh, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Give me the clip. That's such a good, that's such a good thing. That's such a give, give, give me the clip. Give me the clip. I need the clip of me asking him. Send me the clip. I'll put it up. I'll put it up. I'll put it up. That's such a good. Give me, 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 give me the clip. Long time. Oh, 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 yes, yes. You guys are so, oh, you guys got the words for bantering with long time community member. Ooh, ooh, yes. Yes, 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 dude. Okay, hold on. Seven day ban for bantering with long time community member. No clear option to explain or appeal as, as if the platform wasn't dog shit enough. This is some clown behavior. Pick two was the DM I sent a fan after he pulled a card I was hunting on. This is good, dude. Yes. Ask him if he's fine with it. Oh, yes, I'll call him. What, what, ask him if he, what's, I cut his name out of the post. Like his name is removed from my post. So it would just be his voice and, uh, and there's, his name is removed. Say he's gay too. <laughs> dude is shaking in his boots if he actually did report. Well, hold on. Now's your chance to come clean. <laughs> now's your chance. During Pride Month. That's really... If I just add, oh, he's gay too. <laughs> uh, and during Pride Month of all months. Does anyone have the clip of him being like, no, I did not report it? 
They probably have a list of flagged words for first time DMs. Yeah, that's, again, everything you're saying is justified. There need to be options then. You need to give me options then, right? So if you want to say, well, Wubby, that's the auto, then, then give me options. If, oh, it's automated, then give me options, right? Let me appeal it. Have an appeals process or give me a warning. Your A blank might just be a trigger. Then, then, ha then talk to me. Hey, we suspended you from 24 hours. Do you want to explain this DM? Sure. Or hey, even just 24 hours. You can't go back and clip because the VOD isn't published. Fuck, 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 fuck. And nobody clipped it? Fuck. Nobody clipped it? Fuck. Really? Go offline real quick. Get the archive guy. Fuck. You're trying to make it look fake. I don't want to end stream. I'm going to lose half you guys, and I'm tired of that happening. Thank you, Big Dog Show, for the five subs. Fuck. Get him back on the call. Your Just tell him to say it again. <laughs> Thanks, That's so staged. You, Holy shit. You know, fuck it. We'll do it. We'll make a really good clip. No, it is so stupid. Wubby Wubby Woo from Canada, baby. Woohoo. Dude. Just do it. All right, all right, fine. We'll do it. Fuck it. Let's see if he answers. <laughs> I don't think he's going to answer. He's gone. He's reporting me for something else. Okay, get your clips ready, idiots. He's not answering. He's not answering. All right, let's check the subreddit. See what's going on there now while we're waiting. He's not. He's definitely just not answering. Oliver's poopy butt. Oh, hey, hey. Love you, Wubby. Say it back. Hello? You answered, but you're not speaking. Oh, how about now? Hey. Hi. What can I help you with? <clears throat> Uh, so we have to we have to do this one more time. I'm sorry. Oh God! Just 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 to, it's really simple. Just wait, okay? And then I'll let you go, okay? Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. Um. So they're gonna chat. You're ready to clip. You're ready to clip. All right. Are you ready? You ready? Yep. Let's go. Now, for those who are saying scripted, no, we just didn't clip it the first time. So, okay. So <clears throat> you're the dude who got the DM. On record, on record. Well, okay. First off, did you report the DM? No, there. I, I again, I don't even think I know how to report a DM. Uh, when I saw it again, I just thought it was neat that you messaged me. So, okay. uh, no, I did not report that DM. And and did you feel harassed by my DM? Oh God, no. Uh, I just took it as playful banter, and uh, I was not offended, nor was I uh, harassed in any way. And just to be clear, you are a gay man yourself. Wow. Yes. Well, actually, bisexual, but you know, you know that oh, life. Right. On. Okay. All right. Thank you. Love you. All right. Bye. He didn't. He didn't see. Me. <laughs> I love the. I love the. Wow. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this guy fucking hates me now. I really just made an enemy out of a fan. <laughs> and he also, he, dude, he, you know what? I'm going to report him for harassment. He goes, but you know that life. Why are you going to out me on? Why are you outing me, dude? <laughs> but you know that life. Bro, I'm, I'm going to report him for public harassment. Are you kidding me? <laughs> All right. Um, anyone got a clip? I was like, I didn't clip it. Just send the gay part in the appeal. All right, here's a clip. Let's see if this is a clip, or is this going to be E-Rob's nipple again? Okay, here we go. Wow. Yes. Well, no, it's second, just the gay part! What's wrong with you? <laughs> I hate this tree so fucking much. <laughs> is this it? Okay, all right. Um, so they're going to chat. You're ready to clip. You're ready to clip. All right. Are you ready? You ready? Yep, let's go. Yep. Okay, okay. That's it. That's the whole clip. You guys are fucking so stupid. Are you... St guys! What the fuck? Oh my god, that was the whole... <laughs> oh, this is getting funny. Okay. All right, all right. Let's... <laughs> oh boy. Let's see if this one's right. Okay, this one's from Mr. Mustache, so a lot writing on this one. <clears throat> Did you report the DM? No. There. I, I, again, I don't even think I know how to report a DM. Uh, when I saw it, again, I just thought it was neat that you messaged me. So, uh, okay. no, I did not report that There DM. we go! And, and yes! did you feel harassed by my DM? All right, uh, so I'm oh, not God, even, no. I'm not going to tweet this one out, but you know what? I'm going to let you guys have this in your back pocket. 
All right. This is gonna be this is gonna be a community dunk if anyone tries to come at us sideways. All right. You see what I'm saying? So we're gonna we don't even need to have that yet. You see what I'm saying? We 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 got I'm gonna have this in my back pocket. You're saying coward? No, 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 trust me, boys. This is how you do this shit. You, say, you let somebody overstep. You're gonna let some no listen to me, you guys are so you're not listening. You let somebody, some person who doesn't follow me, some random idiot on Twitter go, well, actually, da -da, and then you go, Oh, really? You're gonna speak for them? You're gonna speak for the person, and then boom! That's how you do it, bro. That's how trust me, bro. Trust me, bro. It's an ace up your sleeve, bro. We're playing poker. We got one in the chamber. Yes, dude. I'm gonna. We're gonna shoot somebody. We're gonna take a gun and we're going to shoot somebody with a gun. In a game of poker. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. Best <laughs> interest. All right, uh, all right. So I'm gonna I'm gonna fire this tweet out right here. Ready? So let me let me let me look it over. I'm gonna read it to myself. Okay. Seven day Reddit ban for bantering with longtime community member. Oh my God, who came up with that sentence? You're crazy in chat. Okay. No clear option to explain or appeal. Oh, as if the plot. Oh, and I love this. You're bringing it back to the whole Reddit is dog shit thing because of the spaz shit. Okay. As if Reddit wasn't dog shit. Oh. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, clown behavior. Three clown emojis with four to spare. Pick two is the DM I sent to a fan. Sent to the fan. The gay fan. <laughs> Can I see the fan with a rainbow flag? No, I'm not going to say that. To the fan. To the viewer. To the friend. We're friends now. We're friends now. No. To... <clears throat> the member we'll use member again after he pulled a card i was hunting on stream to my lover <laughs> mention that you can no longer mod I'll, you know what we should no 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 we'll leave it at that we'll leave it at that we'll leave it at that i think people know i'm uh, just add a third image and make it a gay flag that's such a good call all right i'm finding this tweet out get ready guys i'll make i'll make up the part one of two okay okay hold on part one of two and then two of two will just be a pride flag no? Is that bad? Oh, that's bad. Okay, okay. No, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> Mention that you love him. I am in love with him. Guys, come on. This isn't... <laughs> uh, I, I think this does need a two of two, though, so I will... Um... <clears throat> Mention that you kiss. No, we'll leave it at that. We'll leave it at that. All right, all right. <clears throat> Actually, you know what? I think we'll use the clip. What do you guys think? I think we'll use the clip. I think we'll use the clip. Nah, nah, we'll save the clip. We'll save the clip. No, I think we'll use the clip. Nah, I think we'll save the clip. I think we'll use the clip. Nah, we'll save it. We'll save it. Nah, I think we'll use the clip. I think the clip's important. I think the clip's important. I think the clip's important. Uh, the, why is the title not harassed of the clip? Think I know how to report a DM. Why is the title uh, not harassed? This sounds this seems so scripted, guys. Does this include the gay sure. thing? And uh, I was not offended, nor wow. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> dude, Gus Johnson moment, dude. Like actually, just <laughs> wow. Yes. Download the clip. You're right. Okay. All right. We give. Hey, let me cook. Give me a second to cook, boys. AITTS back on while I cook here, okay? Let me cook. Let me cook. Wow. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Let me land. Let, Let me cook. The type of people that enjoyed Avatar 2. D mm, I was going to say true, but I don't, I, don't, I don't actually know if that's a good or a bad thing. All right, hold on. I'm downloading this clip. Me and Payment Webby are lovers confirmed. Yeah, well, he's in chat now spreading... Yo, sh bro, you Did need you to report the DM. Oh, shut up. The sub <clears throat> is exploding with memes of this already good job, boys. <laughs> no way, you guys are. <laughs> I'll check the sub after this. I mean, yeah, it, it, it's 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 ridic. It's ridic. It's ridic. It's straight up ridic. It is ridic. You gotta acknowledge it's ridic. Did you report the? D and the thing is, what's crazy is that somebody on the sub already said i just sent this message to somebody else to see if i get banned so i guess we'll see let's monitor that right in theory they should get banned right all right so one of two i'm gonna hit the tweet button you guys ready if everybody on my twitter you know, ready flop. what do you mean tweet will flop just go like it you don't care 
Link it in chat. I will. I will. I will. I'll link it in chat. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. And you know what? If you, I got you on this right here. What? If you don't want to signal boost it, just hit me with a reply that's like, you wow, know, wow, Wubby, wow. you're so handsome. Wubby, you're not racist. Those kind of things help me, right? Wubby, you look good. Wubby, you're 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 handsome. All right, hold on. Uh, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Here we go. I'm, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna fire it. Man, people be tweeting dumb shit all the time. Okay, a girl just apologized today with a yuka fucking Laylee. Okay, I could complain about me getting banned on Reddit. All right, here it is in chat. So just lie? No, what do you mean? What do you mean lie? I'm not telling you to lie. Okay, I'm going to reply with the two of two. Okay, hold on. <clears throat> All right. We brought uh, the, or I brought the community, community, how do you spell community? <laughs> Words are hard. Community member on stream to ask if he had reported reddit should i should i should i should i say that okay how should i word this chat this is what's gonna go on the clip how should i word this with you see what i'm saying how should i word this with the clip like what should i put which little message should i put before the clip this is a gay man This is a gay man. What, what, you know what I say? <laughs> Clip speaks for itself. <laughs> bye, excuse me, bye. I'll just say, looks like Reddit uh, brought him on screen. Looks like Reddit will ban you for private messages, whether they get reported or not question mark that's fire bro that's fire also he's gay is how i should end also this is my boyfriend also i actually have deep love for this man like it is, it is i have deep love we are connected spiritually three more tweets i am in love with this man i am in love with this man it's pride month and i'm bisexual <laughs> it's pride month and i am bisexual I'm just gonna end it with that. I don't give a fuck. You guys better, you know, you better signal boost me coming out. <laughs> Brought him on stream. On on stream, I put screen like a like an idiot. I'll spell stream with e e because that's that's how you get ahead. Brought him on stream. Looks like Reddit will ban you for private messages, whether they get reported or not. It's Pride Month, and I am bisexual. How's that sound? It's Pride Month, and I am bisexual. I love how that ends. That that is so. That is a powerful ending. Right? Blah 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 blah. It's Pride Month. I'm bi I'm bisexual. All right, I'm linking. I'm tweeting this one too. <clears throat> it's fired. It's fired. It's out. It's out there. It's fucking out there. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna. Okay, boys, get in there. Get in there. Remember, boys, I'm the most handsome lad. I mean, all jokes aside, all signal boost aside, like real talk, all jokes, all signal boost, all you guys helping this, you know, get somewhere. I know we joke around. This is kind of fucking crazy. I want to bring us back to the point that got us here. I, I, I said something in jest to a viewer that was not offensive, that was not harassment, and I got banned from the platform for seven days. A platform that we use for content on stream, that we use to organize people for various things, that I use to connect with you guys. I reply on the subreddit all the time. I clarify things on the subreddit all the time. I use the sub I use Reddit to purchase things, communicate with people, uh, to moderate my subreddit. A seven-day ban. A, like, really, think about this, guys. A seven-day ban for a private message I sent to a viewer that he didn't report, that he wasn't offended by. Fuck both of those that no one could justifiably be offended by, that I meant no offense by. I am a bisexual man. I am a bisexual man on Pride Month. I have seen penises before that I have seriously had to pull myself off of. HP came in my room today and pissed in front of me. <sighs> yeah, there's the, it's pinned by P-Rex. Thank you, P-Rex. It's pinned. Uh, so if everybody goes, give us, give it love, make it be seen, make it be seen. You know, I know there's a meme behind all this and it's funny, but, it, but real talk, 
It, it's crazy. There's a fucking crazy thing to happen. It's crazy. <clears throat> Deserved. I, I might, guys, I'm not even going to take the bait. I'm sorry, but I'm not even going to take the bait. Don't look at it on stream. Your ass is on it. You know what? You can, po I'll give you this. You can post my ass if you like it and retweet. Oh, that's fair. That's fair. I'm not even going to be mad about it. You're not, no reaction from me. If my ass, if it's, if every reply is my ass, if you're liking it, I don't give a fuck. <clears throat> if you suck a dick as a bi man, is it cheating? Reddit's going to wait three days to reply so they don't look homophobic. <laughs> Dude, real. Real. Um, I think that if you're like married or in a relationship and you suck a dick, I would imagine. Yeah. Unless they're like, yeah, I love when you suck dicks. <clears throat> I heard your streamer left you unattended. Okay, chat. This see, this is autism. And I'm I, I'm just gonna Okay. You know, we're not we're not unmoderated because my account isn't there. You re like you're aware of that, right? Like I'm i I'm sorry. What? <laughs> Unless you guys are tag teaming that cock. <laughs> Yo, chill. R slash bi married. Wait, that's a thing. Being a bi chick in a straight relationship is getting really cool with three ways. Three way jokes. Okay, yeah, but being bi as a girl is probably the most resident sleeper information you could give anyone. We get it. You're bi. Cool. We get it. Okay, tell me when the dude's bi. Now we're fucking cooking, dude. Didn't Sweet Anita say it best? All women are like spaghetti. They're straight till you get them wet. We get it. You're bi. You're a woman that's bi. Cool. Anything? How many hands you got? You got two? Let me know when you got three hands. Okay? How many eyeballs you got? Tell me something interesting about you. All right? We get it. Give let, where my bi boys at though. Now we're now we're cooking. <laughs> She's disabled, you sick fuck. Being bi is not a disability. <laughs> 54 months. This is I dumb. Bro, you're in, in the world wrong world. fucking stream. I have made so much more out of Bruce, content out of less shit time. than this. Bro, I can make Brand this the whole stream. Old God. Wubby would have made this you're a four hour segment. Joy. If you think this is dumb, you are in the wrong stream. I'm sweating like a sinner in church. I gotta turn up my AC right now. Reddit, I mean, listen, I don't even care if Reddit responds at this point. <clears throat> Let me have my. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> Let me have my seven day ban at this point. I think the issue is, is that it happened. You can get banned for seven days for a DM you send to somebody that that's not offensive. Let's Nobody that, that that's, that's scary. Bro, they're just posts that just say bastard over and over and over. <laughs> oh yes, somebody gets it. Yes, dude. Okay, somebody post on the subreddit. This is a reference. Yes, yes. I so I am rewatching Sunny in Philadelphia, and we just got to the episode uh, where they play Charty McDennis, and me calling somebody a bastard man is a reference to this scene. And somebody put it on the subreddit. Yes, it, when I call someone a bastard man, it is a direct reference to when Charlie is reading the card or getting read the card for Charty McDennis, and he goes, "Why Charlie hate Dennis?" And he's like, ah, I, I, "I don't think I wrote that one." And then he's like. You, oh, you definitely did. You definitely wrote that one. And Dennis is like having a meltdown because Dennis is a bastard, man. Oh, so good. It's such a good fucking... Oh, good, good. Why Charlie hate? Yeah, why Charlie hate? Copium? Okay, you know, we're doing this. I'm doing this right now. Okay, you. You guys think that you can... I, 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 you think you can hide behind a keyboard, but that's not the case here on this stream. Okay, RKT Jesus. You have, there's two things that you're going to do right now. Neither one of them are what I'm going to ask you to do. Contact Vilified Pina and let's get on a call. We're going to have a conversation. Okay. Unfortunately for you, this is what you're going to do. You're going to leave the chat or you're going to go silent. Nobody ever. So I would love to get you on a call and I would love to hear what you mean by this. Let's hear you rationalize it on a call with me. I'd love to hear. I actually cannot wait to hear what's copium. What's going on here? Please. Get on a call and have a conversation with me. I can't. Oh, he's gone. He already left. All right. Well. <clears throat> well. <laughs> like, do I even need? Do we even need to ban people here? We just need to talk to them. Like, we really just need to talk to them. <laughs> like, I'm sorry. All right. Any updates uh, on Bruce? Love you. Poster is the guy who DM'd you. Wait. This. Wait. Hold on. 
No, it's not. 26 months, I'm a big boy. No, it's not. 33 wubby wubby woo. Someone different. Beans. Got you? What's the joke there? Oh, it's a, it's a, it's a, it, look, it, it's the so video that guy wanted. Like I'm okay with this now. This is our victory like song. Can you repin the tweet, P-Rex? Hey, to my nigga Pac. Live my life as a thug, nigga, until the day I die. Live my life as a boss player, it's even getting hot. These niggas got me tossing shit. I put the top down, now it's time to floss my shit. Keep your head up, nigga, make these motherfuckers suffer. Up in the pins, burning rubber. The money is mandatory, the hoes is for stress. It's trimming the lights down. You broke with the bulletproof vest. Make sure your eyes... Oh, that's it, okay. What, what are you linking here? Oh, it's just my tweet again. Okay, cool. Poggers. I love you, Wubby, you know what? But not it even just way. felt good to get this off my just chest. You know? You know how like you you you, you guys probably know this feeling. Who doesn't? You guys know this feeling of where it's just like sometimes you just need to yell it. You want to vent it out. You don't even you don't even care if it goes anywhere. If there's anything that happens, sometimes no. This isn't me saying coming out of the closet. I'm saying. You know, it's it, it like <clears throat> I was watching a, a a Twilight Imperium documentary today because I'm a loser, and I'm sitting there. I'm like, I want to tell someone about this because I just need someone to know how much I care. That's how I felt about about this, where I'm like, I I I just need I don't you need a therapist? No, I I want I use my Twitch chat, and I think that's frankly that's more healthy. Um, uh, I need an outlet. Yeah, I, and I need... You guys are my uh, uh, therapist. Wubby is just so out of hand. Come on, guys! What are you getting up to tonight? We actually have content tonight. We really, truly do. We actually have content tonight. Uh, but we have so much to talk about, and because Alex is sick, uh, I don't need to slow... I don't need to cut it off at six. <clears throat> exactly what Wubby's been talking about lately? What do you mean? While watching your stream, Master Moondog. What it's like raising. Is what is this? Number. Love you, Big Gingy. Thank you. Love you too. Fifty-two months. Why are you guys all capping? Just trust me. Something constant in my life. Oh. Any other widowers in chat? <gasps> oh no! Oh my God! I you just mentioned widower, and I'm gonna talk about Black Mirror tonight, and it's gonna be impossible challenge. Did, talk did you see about the Miranda Sings apology ukulele song video. She's bonkers. It's on my list, brother. It, we're gonna talk about Black Mirror season six. Uh, challenge try not to kill yourself when talking about the season oh my god y'all still like black mirror black mirror was awesome i'm sorry y'all it's it's black mirror is 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 not it's it's bad it's bad i'm sorry it's not great it's whew, we'll talk about it in a second let's watch this what it's like raising a... I see raising and I think of canes. What it's like raising a toddler captured in 60 seconds. All right. Let's see if I can get through this without saying something mean about a child. Let's see if I can. Impossible. What's going on, dude? Uh, I'm taking a video of poopy, poopy, fucky. Ooh. Ooh, I'm so sorry. A poopy poopy a poopy poopy poop poop. Why'd you say sorry? What? Why'd you say sorry? Well, I didn't say sorry. Just now you were like, oh, I'm so sorry. Mm -hmm. How come? Why did you say it? I want a little ice cube like that. Is it like because you, is it because you said a bad word? Yeah. Which one? Fuck. Yeah. You said that. Yeah, you did. <laughs> Whoops. That wasn't that interesting. I thought he was gonna vomit or, or or spread feces somewhere. That was okay. Why did you post that on my subreddit? Why do I look at my subreddit when I'm live? You guys are fucking useless anyway. <laughs> I went the that was okay. <clears throat> that that okay. Great. Ban him. Okay. Okay. Good kid. Yeah, that was just a... I hate to say it, but I think I made it through. That was just a good kid. And he was... He was kind of cute. And I'm not even mad about it. Check DMs. 
Uh, oh, dude, this guy in chat. Hold on. The dude who I was talking in, about in chat, he wants to get on a call. He messaged Peanut. He said, what's even going on? I went to get a beer and chat's just staring at me. <laughs> hey, buddy, listen, <clears throat> I'm over it. Do you want to talk about it still? We can talk about it. I got over it. Also, I gotta keep it a bug with you guys. I uh, after watching that kid video, I feel like I have. Di I feel like I'm gonna shit my pants. I really feel like I have diarrhea, and I don't know what I do about it. I don't know how long I'm supposed to stream with that feeling. Same, right? What is going on there? That kid is magic. Oh, I feel like I have diarrhea, but I think I can just muscle through it. I think I'm gonna try to turn up the gain. Now, what the f peanut? What are you? What are you? What? <laughs> It's just IBS. I don't now that I'm thinking about it. Fisting moms by the ocean. Oh, what? Bruce this update. There's no f dude. Every day, my Bruce. The this is Bruce. But Bruce the shark. Every day that I think about Bruce the shark, I get a new message. Some I get a new email. There's a new post in the subreddit. Every day there's something new, and every day it's the same shit. Hey, Wubby, I'm in talks with X Lego employee. I'll let you know, and then nobody fucking lets me know. Nobody lets me know. Nobody lets me know anything. So what's the Bruce update? Just go poop? No, what? I don't wear a diaper for nothing. Um, what's the Bruce update? Pending. Keep working, guys. There is still a bounty on Bruce. I do. There were a couple people who've hit up my business email who seemed close, who went radio silent. Um, it's, I wonder if they took Bruce for themselves. Um, uh, so I'm, I'm waiting on them. Did you see the heist? There's a heist. Do you have a link to it? Guys, I'm going to shit my pants. <laughs> Can you link? I'm going to shit my pants. There's a heist. Uh, 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 take five. It's not going to take five. Uh, I got to poop. Uh, just, just to the TTS is on. Uh, I got to poop. I'm sorry. I'm, on, I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. infinite poop you sit on the toilet to poop but the poop never stops coming out of your butt you have to start flushing the toilet every two minutes to keep up you try to pinch your butt closed but that makes your insides hurt the poop accelerates you call 911 the paramedics call for doctors the doctors call for specialists the story trends on twitter you turn down to can we sub that child for extra toast dennis is asshole why reddit hate Chet, I have been feeling kind of down recently, so when I get back, please clap and praise me for going poo. I said when I get back, retards.
fun fish fact chat is looking cute and i love you guys wubby hug chat i'll be right back i have to go uh i'll get my cream uh it's in my bedroom i'll be right back Thank you all for the poop support. I haven't pooped in a while, but seeing that kid awaken something in me. Can anyone help me find him to thank him in person? Wubby, wubby, poo. Sorry, Chad. It popped out again. Let me get my tamping rod and hemorrhoid cream and we'll be good. Fun fish fact, generally speaking. Fish okay. tend to have nice an anal here. vent or cloaca through which they expel waste. However, pooping methods may vary between species as some pass both poop and pee from the cloaca while other fish pee through their mouth. Why is everyone clapping? At Awibowu syndrome, IBS, is a common dysalgia that affects the wild intestine. Signs and symptoms include quamping, abdominal pain, bloating, gas, and diawuia, al constipation, al both. IBS is a chronic condition that you would you need to man. I, I'm just muted up. Um, man, I'm not doing well, guys. My tummy is still hurting after that, and I feel like vomity. So maybe I don't know. I maybe that Chipotle ain't hitting. <sighs> maybe. <sighs> At pay money, Wubby going to Osman's open sauce thing. I'm pr I'm concerned that the Nuzlocke challenge has permanently broken cool Wubby's asshole. Yeah, I might need to go to the doctor pants. soon here because it's getting pants. it's not good, Shit and I don't know what to Shit do about it. Pants. Talkatively, in my best NPC voice. After having several neurodivergent Hi, orgasms, he came deep inside me in a I'm super I'm just going to mute these. I really need to just mute these. I don't know what that's about, but that's crazy. Um, all right. You're probably dying. I think probably. Bro, what's wrong with your asshole? Lots. Have you seen the Grimace Shake videos on TikTok? Of course I have. Everyone has. Please go to the doctor. Will be. I will. I will. I will. The heist, by the way. Oh, this is the heist in question. Let's take a gander. Everybody gander with me. This is... Okay. What? Four arrested in Lego heist at Hill... Wait, there was an actual Lego heist and it wasn't you guys? Bro, this is a real story? Are you kidding me? Bro, guys. Hello? Do you have your notepads out? Police arrested four people allegedly stealing $3,500 worth of Legos. That's child's play. <laughs> See, the thing is, is, if you steal the shark, whoop, if you steal the shark, they're legally obligated to put a price on it then, right? At that point, they go, oh, they stole a Bruce valued at, you know, like, ah, what's it worth, Lego? You tell us. You t And then I just put that money on their desk. I am not feeling good. I feel like I have to go diarrhea again. I'm not feeling good right now. Don't forget, I need the praise. This is a ruse to get you to praise me again.
Bumber Biffteen, Burger Bing, Boot Bettis, B H E Bast Ping, Bud Bant, Bimble, Burger Bing, Burger Bis, Bummy Ones, Boot Bungus. Looks like all that pegging is starting to catch up to me. Better ask Alex to hold back a little next time. Hey guys, it's Wubby from the toilet. I fucked up. I don't have any more TP. Please call Alex or Peanut. Is it me or does it look like the bus is going to talk into the microphone? The story trends on Twitter. You turn down talk show appearances, your septic tank fails, people form a cult, your toilet is finished, volunteers arrive with buckets and shovels, you are completely used to the smell, the poop accelerates, you are moved to a stepladder with a hole in the top step, the poop accelerates, the shovelers abandon the buckets and shovel directly out to... Big thanks to Kid Fisto for loosening my rectum and for the diaper rash cream. Wow, yes. My name is Bob. I have viewed your explosive diarrhea video and McDonald's just curious to know where that was at. I'm from Southgate, Michigan. I'm a blind person and my, my computer has speech on it so that it reads text to me. So anytime I get emails or anytime I go to a web page and you know, so anything that has to do with text text, window eyes will read it to me. I enjoyed it and it was He makes fun of Alex being old and sick earlier. Now he's shitting his brains out on the toilet. The poop accelerates. Uh-oh, gotta go. Uh-oh, gotta go. Oh, gotta go. Uh-oh, gotta go. Uh-oh, gotta go. Uh-oh, gotta go. I think next time I'll drink some of that stupid green beer so I can shit on stream and just key it out. Man doesn't know struggle until you run out of toilet paper and have to take off your left sock and use that as backup. Poop is accelerating. Poop is accelerating to Mach 1. Brace yourselves. <laughs> hey there, Radar. Sorry about your ass. We'll reinstate your 70-30 split. Kisses. Yeah. The poop knows where it is at all times. It knows this because it knows where it isn't. By subtracting where it is from where it isn't, or where it isn't from where it is, whichever is greater it obtains a difference or deviation. The guidance subsystem uses deviations to generate corrective commands to drive the missile from a position where it is to a position in the two. Well, time for a new green suit. Guys, there's no TP, so I must use what I have left. Can anyone find HP? I need his soft, luxurious fur to clean and nurture my sea star. What are we thinking, chat? Is Wubby one of those people that have to get completely naked to take a shit? I would like to welcome DJ Clancy to the community. Please enjoy the gifted sub. <sighs> oh. Oh. Okay, oh God, it's everywhere. It's on the walls, in the sink, in my hair. I like to imagine he has a flap on the suit. 
What in the actual hell is going on? One minute the animal was there, and the next he is violently expelling a porous liquid. You can hear it, watch, listen. First, I was just yapping, now I'm just crapping. You guys are so stupid, I'm making money while having massive diarrhea. Don't let them fool you, chat. This is just a pre-case ritual for poop knife again. Chat, my balloon knot is on fire right now. Give me a sec. Holy shit, I'm a... Uh... Chat, I'm not, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing great. Yeah, yeah, I think I'm, I'm it's it's bad enough that I'm worried it's it's a bug or something. Ed, he did I not get that stop. from me. Danice, you should create a throne wish list that's just six feet of rope and a stepping stool. You know, for the bit. <sighs> did you know when a person takes a large shit and it know. splashes up and it touches them, it is called yeah. Poseidon's kiss. Okay. Clearly the child oh, cast shit. a spell. Did you hear how many times the little guy said poopy, poopy, poopy? I don't feel better. That's chat. That's how the hemorrhoid I... one. We had a good run. There was hope for a time, but in the hemorrhoid one. Nah. I and I have diverticulitis and almost died this year. Spent 115 days in the hospital since last May. Please go to a doctor. P.S. Thanks for keeping me sane. What does that Fun even mean? Fun fish fact. Uh, special needs fish is known as a bastard. Uh... This is next level <laughs> shitting on the clock. That child is a witch with that poop spell. Thank you, ghost boy, for the five. Yeah, chat. I am... Um... I am nervous about the ability to to finish Thank out. You again, but we're chat, gonna keep like going. I said when I was on the throne, I just like being praised. And I know it, we're experiencing problems right now because um, it looks like the bus is talking. Oh, because uh, yeah, uh, I know I'm experiencing a problem right now because normally when I have a big poo, like where I have to run to the bathroom, I'm great. I'm cooking. I feel good after. I feel just as bad. But that's okay. We're gonna. I'm gonna go until I have to go again. Can chat name your hemorrhoid? Uh, yeah, they can. If you gotta, uh, twenty two months. No, no they gotta hit the sub goal if no they want to name my hemorrhoid. I'm sorry. Also, can we just put on a wubby? Also, I'll, I'll give you a picture um, of it if you if you uh, chat. Actually, whoa, whoa, I can't give you guys whoa, whoa, whoa. one right now. My son, stop following me in my footsteps. Next thing you know, you'll be in a parking screen. garage painting the ground with that poop. Okay. All right. All right. So let's get through. We got a few more things, and then we're gonna do this other thing. Okay. Let's talk about Colleen. You have food poisoning, retard. Checking in. I remember when. I remember What's up? When. It's National Women's Month. It's Hermeroid. I remember filling kits. Big easy. Oh, Hermeroid. Oh. Can I find like Zen real quick? Do you guys want to have a Zen minute with me, please? Just real quick. And <sighs> Batakim. I need a Zen. Was that minute. part of the double feature months. content Let's tonight? <laughs> it was not. Alright, I gotta pause all this shit. I just need a minute to find myself real quick because I'm, I'm, um, I'm, 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 it's, it's me versus God right now. <sighs> I'm sorry, guys. This was not the scheduled content. I'm on a I'm on a probiotic. Shut up, you're <sighs> What's a good yogurt? Isn't there like a good Isn't there like a good yogurt I could eat that has like healthy bacteria? What's that what's a good yogurt? 
Yo plate? Hey, Queen Elizabeth's only fans. Thank you for the 10, girl. Greek? Activia. Activia. Can we get some Activia delivered? Instacart, somebody? Let's get some Activia up in this bitch. I've seen Jamie Lee Curtis eat that shit, and she's got crazy titties. Activia. Chobani is the Greek yogurt I think most people use. Or maybe give me some Chobani up in this. Hey, it's me. Hey, I'm a Chobani. <laughs> oh. Yes? You have an emote. Are these pills? Yeah. This is an emodium pill? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Yeah, it's that's for Zen too if you need a little more. Oh thank you. I could use a little more Zen. What uh what is this? Welcome to mindfulness mode. Turn on your speakers and press start to automatically intelligently generate infin infinite amounts of fullness for your empty human mind. A highly respected carpenter once approached an ugly, old harlot and asked her why is it so that you are so admired, you who are merely an ugly, old harlot? Oh, the reason for that is that I do not consider myself an ugly, old harlot any more than I consider myself a carpenter replied the harlot. The carpenter had never before heard such wisdom stated so clearly, and remembered it for the rest of his life, and later in his life, he hung himself. Self-awareness is the intersection between the intrinsic friction of the transcendental and the ambiguity of the impossible. Remember the old saying, shine, pray and be interesting. Care about leprechauns. Repeat the mantra, I am very, very not part of a cult, I am very, very not part of a cult. I am very, very not part of a cult. You really are a demagogue, that's not a compliment. Keep in mind that, if we want Earth we have to accept burning. <laughs> one more, one more, one more. Imagine how it would be if you were not obviously sacrificed. I do feel relaxed now. Thank you. That was great, Booty. Thank you for that. All right, I took the Emodium, baby. We got this stream in the bag. Bag. I feel good. My tummy feels like it's going down a little bit. Uh, I'm going to try to have Yo Play or, or uh, uh, Cholo, uh, uh, what is it called? Chobani for dinner. Um, so I'll, I'll be regular by Friday, I guarantee it. But the show must go on, baby. The show must go on. You know, can I, can I say that this is something that I've been dealing with my whole life where it, and, and it never affected this, you guys know if you watch every stream I I never poo during streams I hate it I think it's I think it's no no it's naughty to poo during streams it's 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 almost taboo to poo during a stream why is that what what why is everyone saying cap you always poo no I don't what are you talking about all right so let me tell you about and it uh, Charlie just put out a video I haven't seen but I'll I'll uh you know what wait let's just uh no I right, Chad do you guys want Charlie's video or do you want me to just recap it myself. Do you guys want Charlie's video or do you want me to just recap it myself? Recap it yourself. All right. We'll do both. Well, we'll start with mine. We'll see if you guys even want to do so. Um, I saw this on Twitter today. I'm just breaking right now. Uh, YouTuber Colleen Ballinger. Repeat this mantra. I will not shit my pants. 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 Colleen Ballinger, who 
I did not know who that was, but apparently they're a huge YouTuber. Uh, Miranda Sings. Is that their name? <clears throat> but they're like very mainstream. Like they, she's been on like talk shows and shit. Netflix, I think. Huge YouTuber, very big mainstream, whatever. Uh, has I don't know the details of this. I don't know anything about it really. I just know that she's being to what is going to be one of the most historic uh, moments in YouTuber apology history. I mean, it's actually kind of unreal if you haven't seen this yet. We've had all kinds of great YouTuber apologies, but this one is on another level. Uh, I present to you a uh, YouTuber Colleen Bouncer addressing her grooming allegations while playing the ukulele. Let me just show you a little clip of that here. This is surreal. Can't believe this is happening. My team has strongly advised me to not say what I want to say. I recently realized that they never said that I couldn't sing what I want to say. My team has strongly advised me to not say this, but they didn't say I couldn't sing it. Thank you, by the way, Tony Pepperoni. That makes me think of Vanessa Hudgens' nipples that got leaked when I was a child. I think. I am, and um, today I only want to talk about the facts. So I hope that you'll be willing to listen. My team has struck. <sighs> So I, I, I haven't watched her whole apology. I've only seen this clip of it, but my God, dude, first off, I, I you know, maybe you could do a, if, if you're going to be tongue in cheek with it, maybe you can do a, uh, a, a ukulele apology, but the allegations are of grooming. I think that, you know, granted, I don't know if they're true or not. I'm not going to weigh in on that because I don't know, but grooming the allegation in and of itself requires a level of careful response that I would probably put the ukulele down uh, uh, before, you know, giving my response to it. People are saying the allegations are very true. Uh, I'm, I'm an, uh, I've been saying this, I say this about everything. I'm a strong believer in, uh, I want to look into it before I just trust that you say it's true. That doesn't mean I'm saying it's not. That means I'm, I don't know. I actually know nothing about the story, but let's watch Charlie's video. That's the intro you guys get. Um, he put, he just put out a video. Let's watch it together. Keep keep talking, Wubby. I'm about to get some Q. Like you're about to get some ass, bro. Next time people are mad at you, you got to apologize with a mariachi band. How, well, see, how could you be mad at that though? If I apologize with a mariachi band, I feel like people are just gonna be pleased. Also, look at this. Charlie's back. He covered up that lead filth. Okay, that 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 G fuel hot garbage. Hopefully, he comes to the to the light side with gamer subs. Okay. Well, I never thought this day would come. A YouTuber just made an apology video worse than Sienna May's iconic interpretive dance. That was epic, though. The, ep the, the dance was epic, but I actually think this one is worse. For those yeah. that don't remember, Sienna May was a TikToker accused of sexual assault, and for some reason... Wait, she was accused for sexual assault and she put out a dance video? She's like, I didn't rape that guy. <laughs> and she marched into the mines of Mordor and hatched the most diabolical plan of all time. The mines of Mordor, Charles? The mines of Mordor, Charles? Okay. Okay. Forged the worst video apology ever, where it was an interpretive dance apology. So she starts fucking boogieing out there, doing some of this, a little bit of a little bit of these. Okay, if only this Epstein video? knew he could dance it all away. Uh, let's let's play a game here. Let's put up a poll for this. I want to see. I want everybody to bet. I haven't seen this video yet. Okay, does Charlie's cat jump up on the desk at one point? Oh 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 f. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We're back. Okay, here's the poll for you guys. Does Charlie's cat jump up on the desk? He keeps it in the video and he pauses what he's saying to address the cat in some way. Okay, I'm gonna say. Charlie's cat does jump on the desk. He interrupts what he's saying to greet the cat or include the cat in the sentence in some way. That's a dog? Motherfucker. I'm not identifying the animal in the background, okay? This video's been out for 50 minutes. I've been live the entire time. Unless I went poop to watch this video. And by God, I'm ashamed to say it, but she even did some of this. 
just kind of downplaying the entire situation. And keep in mind, it was sexual assault accusations that also had a video as well. So there was a ton of evidence and she still just tried to do like an apology interpretive dance. I did not think there would ever come a time that someone makes a worse response than that. But who? I'm voting meow. How wrong I was. Oh, this is it. Oh. Since I saw my face, I haven't been doing so great, so I took a little break. Oh, God. Okay, this is a 14 minute video. I'm not gonna watch the whole thing. I'm just, I just wanna see this part. A lot of people are saying some things about me that aren't quite true. This is so unreal. I kinda just wanna watch her video. Yeah, it's true, though. Just as long as it's entertaining to you. That bleeding in your ear. Oh, my God. What? Dude, this is so crazy. Here's is normal. This is a ukulele apology video she's turned her accusations and her response into a disney musical number here i suppose she, she's she got a whole little broadway moment here to sing and Unhinged. talk about it now before getting into it let me give some context on what she's apologizing for colleen ballinger is most known for her miranda sings character if you did anybody know or watch or on YouTube to play. for a long time did anybody know or watch miranda before. sings before this i don't even know who that platform. is she even had her own Netflix Yeah, a show. lot of people... Oh, a and lot of no's. Some recently, yeses, though. Another YouTuber named Adam McIntyre has really started to spearhead this information about Accused her of past. grooming and, and bullying underage fans. All right, let's knock one of those out right now. Who in my chat is under 18? I'm going to I'm gonna bully the fuck out of you right now. Okay? Rise up. Rise up. I'm going to... Uh, you're... Oh, brother. Oh, brother. The bullying one, it's like, okay, well, what's the Everything grooming that's one? Everything to them. Make, hold on. Uh, alleged conversations taken from a group chat uh, that these people are both a part of included Ballinger asking for an ass photo of asking female fans to describe their first period. I don't know how weird that is. Is that weird? I felt. I feel like girls always be talking about their periods. Is that not something you ask about? Logman, thank you for the 10. And making fun of a fan who got a tattoo in her honor. Th th again, normal behavior. Uh, anyone who gets a tattoo of me, I'm going... That's very weird. Fair enough, chat. At the time of the conversations, she was in her 30s and they were 14 to 16. Okay, I should have read that first. That's definitely weird. As well as the group chat that she used to have with a lot of her fans that were minors. That's wild. And the way she conducted herself. Uh listen, listen. Okay, Colleen, listen. The, 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 if you're going to have a group chat, okay, you can at least have like some sort of age verification process she's been here, accused lady. Of like asking how do you, how do, what is, I, I feel like, okay, I'm not even 30 yet, but by the time I'm 30, right, currently, in current year, I don't even know how or what type of enjoyment I would get out of a conversation with a 14 year old. Like, I'm not trying to be, she knew they were that young. No, that's the point I'm making is that, when you're, I'm not even 30 yet. Stop saying I'm capping. I'm not 30. What I'm saying is, when was, the, genuinely, chat, if you're in your mid-20s, late-20s, if you're in your early-20s, when was the last time you talked to a 14, 15, 16-year-old? They are retarded. Like, there is nothing they can offer you that, that's even like like I'm not saying she fucked these kids. I don't know what the allegations say here, but like even entertainment wise, you are. I mean, it's it, it's hard for me to even write. It's like okay, I'm 19 years old and I even agree. Like yeah, I even think at 19, what do you? How do you get along with a 14 year old? The only young kids I talk to are my nephews and nieces, and I bet when you talk to them. It's like talking to uh, like someone who has like a disability. From her fans. And again, <laughs> most of these fans it is minor, like talking to a child. You instantly go, oh, really you're a child. Weird videos to them. It's just there's been a ton of evidence of very unacceptable shit. So she's been All accused right, of like grooming as well as being a predator. And this video that she made is her response to those very serious allegations. All aboard the toxic. She asked them what their favorite position is. Oh boy, that's a bad look. I am that's... a high school teacher. Can confirm 15 to 16 are gross. Well, they're just, they're gross. I'm not even gonna say, they're just, and I say this with peace and love, they're kind of regarded. I mean, 15 to 16 years old are kind of regarded. They are, right? And I'll even, I'll give her this, right? If she's talking to someone and they go, oh, by the way, I'm, I'm 15, 16, it's like right there, 
if you if this is when when you hear that from someone that needs to put up this internal wall of like cool any sort of engagement from this point on is like child it's it, 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 like come on chugging down the tracks of misinformation the toxic gossip track. this is so unhinged dude you got one way ticket to manipulation station I don't know. Alex is saying, I don't know. Based on what I've seen, not much to be fair, but she seems super autistic. <laughs> Are you saying that explains the response, not the actions? Nah, she's given us a one-way ticket to defecation. <laughs> I want to see more of just the playing. Hey, tie me to the tracks and harass me for my past. These rumors look like facts. If you don't mind the gaps, I won't survive in the crash. But hey, at least you're having fun. I'm sorry to keep pausing this so. F Bro, this is this is crazy. Honestly, she just she just says things and does things that are weird and inappropriate, but it doesn't seem sexual. I would need to look at it. I don't know, and that's all. It's also like. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know anything about it. She's a bit retarded. Okay, I'm not gonna watch this whole video, but she's like, am I cute? Yeah, but this, you know what that kind of reminds me of though? That kind of reminds me of like the Michael Jackson defense. Like he slept with those There's kids no in a bed. There's no for people to think that you are diddling kids than by writing a song about it. <laughs> you know what I mean though? Like, like Michael Jackson didn't fucking, didn't rape those kids. He was a kid. He just slept with them like kids do, you know? That's kind of the defense I'm seeing for her. And it, it doesn't, listen, it doesn't hit the ear quite right. You know what I mean? What kind of content did she make? Hold on. Miranda sings. I want to see the kind of content she made. She's uh, old YouTube. She was on Good Mythical morning like three or four times. And Kimmel at least once. This is her, her whole shtick. Just regarded awkward singing about anything in her life. This is her most viewed video on YouTube. You guys ready? Hey guys, it's me, Miranda. Today I'm so excited for my video because I'm reacting to TikToks. Not to be confused with TikToks, uh. which aren't like Chase, but not as fun. TikTok is this really cool app where you can lip sync to things. Hello, talent. So I want to get on and look at the competition. I think I'm going to become a TikTok star pretty soon. So first of all, make sure you're following me on TikTok. And second... Okay. There are people like me in chat right now. To the people like me in chat. Was this not the most shocking thing to cut to? Uh, when, I, when I heard she did YouTube, this is not what I expected. Not even close. First of all, let's get to watching these videos. <sighs> God, stuffy nose today. <laughs> I think the most embarrassing thing about these fans coming forward is that they have to admit that they were a fan. <laughs> They're like, man, yep, yeah, I was in the group chat too. <laughs> <laughs> she said publicly that she based her Miranda character on an autistic family member. Poor kid. Oh no, what? Oh my god. See, I make jokes, but that's fu Burn that's crazy. Fire. She's the perfect okay. example of what a funny girl is. Basically, she thinks she's funny, but she's not. Ten-year-old Ash ate this up. Okay, can I keep it a buck? Can I say something kind of fucked up? I feel like this is humor for, like, middle school girls. Sorry, not trying to be rude or anything, but this gives me... Uh, the the girls today who who like grew up on this in middle school, like girls my age today grew up. I don't know how old this is actually, but that's what this that's the energy this gives me. Like I could see a twelve year old girl being like, she is the funniest thing in the world. She gets me. She gets me. Oh no, legit. Really? That's me. I mean, there's nothing there's nothing wrong with that, right? I like. I've God, I liked the male cringe equivalent of this when I was a kid. Let's see. What the freaking heck? I didn't know there was magicians on TikTok. It was like this, and then... Oh, I just did it. It's not that hard. <laughs> oh, is that James Charles? He's wearing lots of makeup. Whoa, porn! Put on a freaking shorts! Oh, look, I can see his entire freaking nipple! That was inappropriate. Oh, so romantic. Oh, one of them can fly. Well, I was not expecting that. That girl has four legs and four... Okay, yo, guys, I know this is, listen, I feel like I, if anyone, I'm allowed to say this, because you know your friend, you have your friend who sits around and goes, bro, doing YouTube is so easy, like these, okay, I think as someone who has a career in the online space, bro, this shit used to be so easy, 
This bitch got a Netflix show for this kind of... Bro, this... Co I feel like my mother gives this kind of commentary. This was so easy. What year did this video come out? Hold on. I'm sorry, but that, like... Good commentary, in my opinion, takes some amount of skill, right? Now, I'm not saying I'm always given the greatest commentary in the world. I'm not saying that. But we can all agree that this is... This is only four years old? Bro, what? You, okay, this... I thought this video was way older! And I, well, Bobby, you watch The Sims? Yes, I do watch The Sims, but the difference between me watching The Sims once a week on this channel, that is not the same as a dedicated upload. Hey, but it's upload. your friend, Ham. Shut up! You have the power to not play that video again, please. I'm gonna play it again. Um, the difference is, is this is a dedicated upload on her main channel, right? When I did commentary videos on my main channel, they were thought out, right? They, 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 they like, you know what I mean? My Sims reactions is cat. That's what I do on Twitch. Is cat. I would never upload something like that. Like you know what I mean. Uh, this is bad. How is this for? Th this is not four years ago. Bad. The, the humor and like effort put in here. This is should be like OG YouTuber bad. More feet. Okay, she's a shoe. In the water. Whoa! Do you see that? She took an entire paper out of the shoe. I was not expecting that paper to come out. So that was really incredible. What the heck? All these boys not wearing any clothes. Whoa, invisible stairs? Those naked boys just climbed up a bunch of stairs. My jeans. Yeah. Next one. You guys are saying stop, but you know, I am locked in now. Okay, it's a pretty girl. Putting her. Oh my god! Wait, what? Bro, also TikTok should needs to be burned to the fucking ground, dude. I don't know what's worse, like the reactions or the actual the content she's reacting to. It's so bad, bro. TikTok is a virus. It is. It. I mean, it is just melting. She minds. also admitted that she got her childhood dog put down as a child after she was antagonizing it, and it bit her. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna comment on the like, ra dude. The, the random dog piling stories. It's the same shit. You know, I don't know anything about that. Okay, just focus on the grooming allegations because that's the kind of shit, right? Where if imagine people are talking about me in another chat and they're like, "And he does this Asian voice on his stream." No, no, like this year he does this Asian voice thing, and when he when Wubby gets scared, he says anti-Semitic stuff. No, like he does. No, listen, when he gets scared, he'll say anti-Semitic stuff. It's like, I don't know about any of that with the dog story you just told. I don't know about that, but I don't need to know about that. If she grooms kids, you know what I mean? I'm Let's kidding. keep watching. So she just put her fingers on her nose and then they're still on her nose. God, this is so funny. It's weird to say, right? It's hard. It's weird to, hello? It's weird to say, right? Oh, no offense, but she's not a very good magician. Thanks. Is that Jojo Siwa? She took out the bow. That girl is mean because she's in black and white, so that means she's mean. I'm sorry. I gotta stop. I'm sorry. You're right. You're right. I gotta stop. I will give subs to make it end. Well, I gotta keep going then until that okay. happens. So. Oh, really <laughs> cool. I mean, come Aww. on now. You're the money maker. Thanks. Is that I will leak your IP one? if you don't shut it off. Oh my God. Bye. Jesus. It's off. You guys realize this is popular content, 56 million views. Maybe you guys don't get it, okay? Maybe you guys aren't funny. See, this is the thing that I always say when people say, people will cite viewership as a sign of good content. And that, I swear to God, that shit has stopped work. That like, that argument has stopped working since the beginning of YouTube. That video had 56 million views and they weren't ironic those were fans those were viewers right viewership is is an indication on 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 how much of a widespread audience you can grab not anything not talent i'm sorry it's it has let's just call a spade a spade here right um thank you take i'm stopping the video thank you for the subs thank you tank urden Thank you, Fabled Triple. Some code monkey gifted 10 really wanted it to stop. All right, all right. Can you eat more of those gummy bears? I can't. I can't. Ray William Johnson? Well, that was, yeah, that was hype. I mean, it's really cringe now. Have you tried to watch a Ray William Johnson video now? Like, like, not what he makes now. An OG one now? Hold on. Old Ray William Johnson video. I mean, it, it's bad. It's, it's old Ray William Johnson videos. It's like, this was the commentary we were thirsting over. Is this one? Oh. oh, God. 
equals three was good chat i hate to break it to you it, it wasn't it wasn't it was so like it it had its purpose right but the humor in it is like do i need to remind you guys of doing your mom We'll get to that. Hold on, Helen. This is from 11 years ago. All right. Okay. So our first video, it's a cat video. Yeah, I know you're already pissed off at me, but I don't want to hear it. Man, I'll turn this fucking car around because this particular cat video is really cool. Check it out. Damn it. That's fucking priceless. Look at, look at that. Look at that. Cat just gets up on two feet. Oh, I'm just going on a leisurely stroll. Bro, this was the biggest YouTuber on the platform at the time. <laughs> George Orwell would be shitting his pants right now. Now this Cro-Magnum kitty got about 2 million views in just four days. Holy wow. You know, I've never skipped. I was a fan. I was, a dude, I watched every upload back in the day. Like this was the guy who didn't watch this. But man, it doesn't hold up. Man, it doesn't hold up. There is nothing timeless about the humor. Paired a cat like that so bad that he just like stands up on two feet and leaves like, like, man, f you guys. He's like flipping you the paw, goes and flips his fucking litter box over. You get the point. And yeah, I know you guys hate cat videos, but wait until I make this bastard dance. <laughs> Bro, it's un it seems like a parody at this point, dude. Oh, it's so crazy. <laughs> See, internet cats dancing just makes <sighs> everything better, doesn't it? I swear to you, the internet is made up of gifts of like fucking dancing cats. But you know who else loves child molesters? The comment. Whoa, 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 what the fuck, dude? What? I'm fucking pardon? <laughs> it just, that felt so out of nowhere. My question of the. Wait a minute, that's wrong. My script is wrong. This is oh. all I keep my script on my phone. Uh, and while I fix this, you guys, check out this video. It's the skate... What? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> ...here at the yeah, X yeah, Games, yeah. and he's being interviewed about... Actually, I have no idea what he's being interviewed about, because that's not the interesting part of the video. The interesting part of the video is the fucking child abduction going on behind him. It's gonna be fun, like, skating a different kind of contest, you know? You don't want to just get the <laughs> okay, so, that's um, kind of funny. Yeah, X Games is gonna be sick. Okay, that's that is that is not it. That is the slowest and most pathetic child abduction of all time. Tell me you saw that. What the fuck? is that guy? A no, I missed the six foot four black man, three hundred fifty pounds, pulling a child through the through the grass in the back. No, I totally missed it. I t I could I cannot believe I missed it. Ducking a kid right in front of the camera? You gotta be kidding me. Man, kidnappers have no class these days. Man, come on, have some decency. You snatch a kid up, you gotta do that shit in person. What did it just say on the screen? Other notable black child molesters. You know, y'all say different time, and like, yeah, if you go watch old like movies from like older movies, you know, you could you could hear Bradley Cooper saying the gay f slur casually in the hangover right those are things you expect to see right with older things you know it's like wow that word is not you would not hear bradley cooper use that in a movie nowadays right of course you wouldn't uh this is not an example of like oh it was a different time where's the joke there's no jokes it's just it's huh you gotta do what that. word I, I can't say the word on twitch but it's it's a f private. word don't let people see you you'll embarrass the kid oh but not this Did big you just say chuck berry black guy he doesn't even have the common courtesy to lift the kid off the ground oh don't worry mr kidnapper we'll get you a fucking wheelchair next time so you don't have to do any work back in my day the kidnapper are you seeing the unhinged text on the on the dude this is crazy would sit at the end of the schoolyard in a big i just had I had to walk uphill both ways just to be full oh White van with no windows, offering you all the candy you want and a free ride home. <laughs> which is a real- Getting kidnapped is what stunned it's my growth. a good deal if you think about it. Oh, relax, you oversensitive bastards. Here, let me get you some tampons. You can put them in your purse for later. Come on, guys, it's, it's not a real kidnapping. But if it were, and that big ass black dude were dragging me across the lawn like that, I'd probably have to let him. I mean, so what if he anally rapes me? Anally. What? What the fuck is this, dude? The word you're referring to is the name of the brown beaver 
from Angry Beavers. Bro, he does a slowdown on oh, anal on. rape! Like that? I'd probably have to let him. I mean, so what if he anally rapes me? Anally rapes me, rapes me. I don't want him beat- ah, Three times! Three fucking times! Guys, I didn't cherry pick this video. I searched e what, what did I actually search? Hold on, let me find the exact search. Oh, look, 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 look. Old Ray William Johnson video. That's- this was- I just picked the first one! me up this last video is just honestly it's just i can't stop watching i can't stop watching and horrible i mean who submits these terrible ass videos to me it's this video of this kid from the philippines who like sings stupid damn video hi my name is sergeant gilbert i'm singing the justin bieber the baby Man, did you see that? That was... That, that was really good, actually. I mean, damn, homeboy's got talent, like, spilling out of his pores. He's literally sweating talent. He is sweating and vomiting. <laughs> Bro, no wonder we're all racist, you know? This, is, I, this was getting fed to me when I was, like, a teenager. <laughs> It's like there's like I I love an edgy joke and maybe I've grown but like it's not edgy. There's no ed the edge is like it's hard to explain and you guys know I'm not above I'm not explaining it to people who don't understand, but it's hard to explain to someone who doesn't understand what an edgy joke is in my opinion, but you know one and you know when one isn't. And like what's the joke here? What's the joke? It's just it's just the punchline is racism. Remember this stereotype song? YouTube really used to be the Wild West. No, bro, it really did. But like, it's funny. Be you know, okay. We think of the Wild West of YouTube as like Filthy Frank, Max Mofo, anything for views, iDubs. Uh, there's probably a few others, many others that I can't think of. You I never, Ray William Johnson somehow got away from that. And no, I don't remember, when I, th until now, I don't remember Ray William Johnson as being edgy. I remember, oh yeah, he's that cringe. He uh, was like AFV for our generation. He clips for our generation on YouTube, right? That's all he is. Like, this is so, no, cancel him. No, 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 no. Canceling him is beyond cringe. Okay, this was, this was very much, this is a time capsule because this was shit on the front page of you. If you're gonna cancel him, then you need to cancel YouTube. You need to cancel everyone who paid him, everyone who was a fan of him. I mean, we all grew out of it. And I think he did too, but this was normie shit. This was shit you would put on casually back in the day. This, I'm tell. I can't, overstate his influence when he was on YouTube doing this. I mean, this was so commonplace and so socially accepted, nobody gave a fuck on you. Uh, maybe maybe if you were in your 30s at the time and you were seeing this, this probably offended you, but let me speak as a teenager at the time, as a teenager who was watching this time, this was so, you didn't even think twice about this shit. Nobody gave a fuck. He's racist, but he didn't, uh, He's racist, but doesn't say the the F word. He's definitely grown out of it. He still posts. I haven't seen William Johnson in, in probably 12, 13 years, and bro. And talent. Now that video got like 200,000 views in a week. And the kid himself has an interesting story. He sells these like handmade flutes on the street. He's a street vendor in the Philippines. You ever experience and a racist Mandela effect? What does that mean? Oh, is this a racist Mandela effect? By the way, that should that should show you how time capsuled this video is. He's describing this viral video that got 200K views. There's probably 10,000 YouTubers who posted their, their normal content this week that got 200K views. And that's a very normal week for them. Very normal. Very. Part about the videos, he's got like tons of songs up in his repertoire. He's like the... the Filipino 200k back in the day was viral. The way you are. <laughs> By the way, I see people saying this already. I'm not saying 200k isn't a lot now. You're misunderstanding my point. Ray William Johnson covered viral videos. 200k on YouTube would not be considered viral anymore unless you unless you're somebody who doesn't have a presence. If you random guy on YouTube posted a video and it got 200,000 views, that would go that would be going viral for you. Right? He didn't cover viral videos for you. He covered internet virality.
You see what I'm saying? 200k back the then equals was huge. Three thug Jedi video. He has a thug Jedi video. Well, we're gonna pull that up. Now, props to the guy who took the time to yeah, film this really and upload it to you. Your own audience, you should just put on some old Onishian videos. Old Bro, Onishian I was watching beheading videos? videos on Rotten.com before this guy first discovered hair gel. <laughs> dude, actually true though. Okay, I, I, dude, I remember my first ISIS video. <laughs> Where were you when you watched a man get burned alive in a cage? I know where I was. I was in middle school. <laughs> it's like, fuck, man. I'm so much happier the internet is, in general, an easier place to avoid that shit now. Because back in the day, it was not as easy to avoid it, right? You can definitely lock down shit better. than When I was a kid, my dad had no clue how the internet worked. It was so new. And it was just, you. I mean, fuck, you go on Reddit. And it's like, ooh, jailbait, front page, front and center. Ooh, ooh, uh, watch people die, front page. Ooh, I'm going to see a war crime today. I don't even know what I'm looking at, right? Just It's just scarring me. Holy fuck. Because it's one of those videos that just it makes you feel good when you watch it. We haven't seen one of those in a while, you know? A video that makes you want to, like, go up and hug, like, a fluffy bunny or, like, a squirrel or, like, a Jewish guy. I don't know, like. Ham, any thoughts? <laughs> Ham, thoughts? Bro, what? I want to be clear here, though. Like, it, 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 uh, this is not like a fuck Ray William Johnson thing at all. And I maybe I'm too kind and too forgiving. But I don't see this as, <gasps> he wasn't a monster. It's more a, I am cringing at the time. The time Bobby, has changed. Do you changed. remember Ari Shafir's The Amazing Racist? I think I saw those when yes. I was 10 or 11. Oh my God, yes, dude. Holy fuck. That shit was insane. Ari Shafir, The Amazing Racist. Yeah, that was crazy. Not By the way, not gore for people who don't know. Just very offensive. Just makes you want to hug something. Now, the kid is a great singer, but let's be real. There are lots of videos of kids singing wonderfully all over the internet. I know, I see them all the time. But people are fascinated by this particular kid because he's poor. I mean, how could such a lovely voice come from someone so poor? Now, don't get me wrong. I'm not being mean. I think the kid's great. I hope this video goes super duper viral and he gets all kinds of recognition but i have two words of advice for the talented young lad one don't go to the x games i hear there are big black guys there who are ready to make you their prison bitch i mean those guys say they're gonna give you free candy but no matter how naked i got bro they this never is only gave one me video free candy. regarded goku probably has got to have even worse shit floating around see, no way you just called him regarded goku see the thing is though you got to think about this for a second in in 12 years that's how long ago this video was or 11 close to 12 years ago are we gonna look back at this stream and play a clip of you saying regarded Goku and go, oh, now nah, regarded Goku is timeless. That's so funny. Andy, I mean, you, any free, shut up. And two, if you're going to be an internet music act, you're going to need some backup dancers. And I just happen to know a couple. <laughs> huh. You know, I love you guys. I threw those cats in just to piss you guys off. But you know what else pisses you off? The comment question of the day, which comes... Oh my god, the comment question of the day! How can I forget about this, bro? A couple of ladies named Bam, and they said... Our comment question of the day... Look, dude, this is so... Oh my god. The way these girls look right now is... I am I am a child again. Wait, that's this is coming off incorrectly. This reminds me of my childhood. You Like, the quality of the camera, the style of their hair... They're 12 chat. What I, you're not understanding what I'm saying. This is, stop making, stop being gross. Stop being gross. Okay. I'm not making, this is not a sexual comment. I'm saying, this is how I grew up, dude. This is what the girls looked like when I was this age. It's, it is so, it, God, it did not age well. It's this with the, and like a, like a razor flip phone. Oh my God. What's that chasing you? So what's chasing you? Leave your interesting or creative responses in the comments section. Oh, he, this guy knew. This guy figured out YouTube at the time. This is so smart. What a smart way to get a community talking in your comment section. Below. Or on Facebook, Twitter, or Google Plus. Bro had Facebook, Twitter, and Google Plus that long ago. This man was 
Fuck, dude. But thanks for watching today's episode of Equals 3. I'm Ray William Johnson. Just, and if you hang out with me, I'll give you a ton of free candy and a free ride home. And I approve this message. So tell me, guys, what's your freaky talent? Anally rapes me. <laughs> Those girls' style was off the cheesy. It was. It was. Oh, my God. All right. We have a, another a viewer suggested video. Thug Jedi. What is this? Okay. Is this a particularly bad one? Is this a song? Do you guys even know what this is? Booty, I want to apologize to you. I know we have a lot of content to do tonight, but I'm, I'm distracted. I hope you understand. What's happening, guys? Man, these snowstorms across the country. What is, what is Thug Jedi? Let me skip around here. Is there a video with Thug Jeff? Oh, yeah. oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No, that I don't usually review fight videos. Not that this show is so high class, but I kind of find them to be a little trashy. However, I've decided to make an exception for this particular fight video. Right? You see these two? <sighs> Can I even sh hard R incoming? Wait, what? Hard R incoming? Hold on, I'm gonna- Wubby, stop. He says the N-word in this video. Oh, wait, wait, like how though? Hold on, I'm gonna mute so you guys can't hear. And I'm gonna watch it off screen real quick. Hold on, I'm watching it. Okay, I, I can't show the fight either. I can't show the fight because he just got, um, it's still on? What do you mean it's still on? It's not muted? Yes, it is. You can't hear, what did he just say? 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 Yeah, no, he didn't, you fucking idiots. Okay, I'm gonna mute my mic. All right, he does say the N-word. He does, whatever. Yeah, it's not as bad as you guys are making it seem. He, he, so in the video, the, the, it's a fake video of, uh, of two guys fighting and then they pull out lightsabers. And the dude on the right, the black guy, gets stabbed. And he goes, damn! And he says the N-word. And then Ray William Johnson just goes, quotes him. You guys made it seem like he dropped a hard R, like, f calling someone, or, or... I'm not justifying any of them, I'm just saying, you made it seem something way different. Uh, okay, hold on. One of those gets me banned on Twitch, is the point I'm making, and the one he did doesn't. Hold on, let's just do doing your mom real quick, because this is what I want you guys to... I really want... I just don't want do this to ever be forgotten about. This needs to be... What, where do they put like things, important pieces of like art and history? It's not the Smithsonian. It's the it's it's Smithso Smithsonian. It's the uh, um, tasteful N word. See, you said that. I didn't say that. You said that. Um, the museum in the L Lorve, in the library, in the Hard Rock Cafe. That's right. This needs to be in the Hard Rock Cafe. Uh, and here, I'm gonna, I'll let you in on a little secret. I was, I think, 15 or 16 when this came out. I loved this. I thought this went so hard. Oh, well, why are we fast? Sorry, I was watching the other one on fast mode. I wanted to hear Ray William Johnson say the N-word in 1.75 speed. Doing your mom, do it, doing your mom. Doing your mom, do it, doing your mom. Do it, doing your mom. Do it, doing your mom. You know we straight. Do it, doing your mom. Is that, is that, is that, is that Dr. Strange? What's his name? Benedict? Oh my god. 
I was doing your mom, yes, yours. I'm doing your mom, yes, yours. <laughs> oh my god! Dun 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 picking out your drawers. For somewhere in the Walmart, picking out your drawers. Pick Dolly Parton hair like an 80s prom queen. Dolly Parton hair like an 80s prom queen. I remember it, dude. I remember it. Queen, but her ass was looking good all up in the mom jeans. I punched her in the checkout line and said, Yo, baby, what's up? She had two gallons of milk and I was staring at her jugs. Five minutes later, she agreed to get with me. So we went and rocked the minivan like giggity, giggity, giggity. I was riding your mom, which is Mario Kart. I gave a lift back to a crib because a cow wouldn't stop. She invited me in the house and we started banging out again. How many times I tapped that ass? Over 9,000. Yeah. This is worse than when he said the n-word. This is what he should be canceled for. Purges filth from our brains by playing Mexican radio? What is that? What is Mexican radio? I'm looking it up. I don't know what that is. Mexican radio. Why did you want me to play this? In my kitchen. Yeah. Roll Cadillacs, never lie on rap. Smoke killer herb till my lungs collapse. Lost two grand last night shooting crafts. Then I hit the Ritz and bought a few laps. Just got a letter from my old best friend. Doing 25 in a federal pen. Wanna come home, but he said until then. Could I look over his three children? They wake him up at 5 a.m. That's not a great thumbnail. Wait, this is it? I don't, what is this shit? Okay, we're done with this. Fuck this. Um, <laughs> anally rapes me. <laughs> oh boy. You know, hey, the original's better. I don't even, I don't know why TT even suggested that. I don't fully understand that. Miranda Sings was on True Life on MTV. What the fuck? Where wasn't she? This girl was everywhere. I don't know how these people break out into that stuff. But either way, they ruin it for everyone else, don't they? Um, okay. Booty, should we do this now? Is it time? Is it time? E -er, e -er. You played the wrong one? Bro, he said play Mexican radio, and I searched Mexican radio, and I played Mexican radio. What is this? Okay, <laughs> is anybody else confused? I'm not saying it's bad. I just, why, why? I don't understand. Unforgivable, stop, I'm done, we're done. Okay, uh, we're gonna be setting up here for uh, a YouTuber merch review. Booty and Peanut have compiled a list of YouTubers merch. I am releasing merch in July. And because my merch is poggers, I have the utmost authority on what good merch is and bad merch is. So, I'm go- How- Where did the subs go? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? God damn it! God damn it! Sorry. Uh, anyway. Uh, hey, Bodie, thank you for the 10. Good <laughs> fuck, dude. Anally raped as Ray William Johnson would. Dwayne, you gifted 100. You're making me look bad here, man. 
You're gifting a hunter. You're making me looking bad. You're making me look bad. L plus ratio plus you fell. Bro, I fell off. I was never on. Dwayne, thank you for the hundred. Scott McNecklace, thank you for the five. Appreciate you. I'll do it again. Don't do it again. Get convince these other bozos, bro. You don't need to be gifting a hundred again. Christ on a log. Thank uh, hey, booty. What's up? Hi. 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 Um, you want me to leave some stuff here and then you can pick it up? I so uh, I'll send you. Um, uh, uh, what's the word? Hidden messages in Discord. Okay. So with the links, if there are some, just so that um, you have stuff. So I'll send you some relevant links. We could get in a Discord call if you wanted, but okay. For the most part, most things. Maybe okay, I'll, I'll look and if I have questions, I'll ask you. Yeah, um, I'll be listening. thank you and thank you, Beef of a Burp. Thank you for the five, Scott McNecklace, Dwayne. Thank you both. Appreciate you guys for the second favorite shirt. I'm wearing my second favorite shirt. I've been wearing this shirt for three days. I've been wearing this shirt for three days. It has so many stains on it. I'm sorry. I I, I forgot I was gonna be out of my costume for for stream today because we have very exciting today, boys. Not beige, brown. Uh, did you guys hear that Asmongold? I my friends sent me a thing about this. I don't know if it's real. Asmongold wiped his bloody gums on his wall. Is that real? Is that real? Did he? Re is that a joke? Am I missing something there? What is the joke there? He shared a photo. Is it a condition that he has? Is he okay? <laughs> what? Is, what? Is, I mean. Yes, it's real. He's revolting. I'm not going to say that about him. I just, I, I, I need to know what th that boy just ain't right. Well, hey, thank you guys for the subs. I just came and appreciate you. You mean the world. Thank you. Thank you guys. Appreciate you. Thank you. Appreciate it. So what do we do? Booty and peanut, mostly peanut, uh, came up with a list and then booty refined the list and added some stuff to it. Just trying to give credit where credit's due. And then booty went shopping. We have purchased a bunch of YouTuber merch products things that youtubers make i'm going to pull up either the site uh, uh or like their their announcement booty has accumulated all of them into a list here's what we're gonna do my shirt inside out my shirt is an inside out uh i am going to try if it's a product i'm going to try it i'm going to review it we're going to watch something about it and then i'm going to guess how much it costs uh, and hopefully we can we can do that. Will you be trying Mr. Beast chocolate? Maybe you should wait and find out. Also, I find it, you know what I find funny? I find it funny how there are people in my chat putting in which YouTuber or streamer they've seen do this, okay? But if you name more than two, and I've already seen three different names, that should tell you that this has been done a billion times. So who am I stealing from then? <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Who, who, if, if you're accusing me of, you got this from Cold Ones, well then where did Cold Ones get it from? You know what I mean? Hey, buddy, listen, I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. There was a time where we were all watching Jubilee videos, okay? I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. We're cool with it. We are very cool using each other's content. I'm gonna keep it a buck, okay? Lyric did this today. Wait, Lyric did this today? We've been planning this for, this took uh, three weeks to get all the merch in. So, we did, we did steal it from... <laughs> We did steal it from Lyric today. I don't even know if he actually did, but it's kind of funny if he did because it wouldn't be possible for get the sh to get the shit in today, but we did steal it from him. We did. Tom Segura did this on his stream, and I believe it. I believe he Trying didn't. Frank okay. Has been all lubed. Also, this was a, a this idea was pitched by Peanut. Um so, okay. First product, is this the first one? Okay, happy dad. Who, who's, who's, I, you know what, P Booty, I think I should be in a call with you. It's more YouTuber products than just merch. Okay, YouTuber product doing your mom, review. Doing, oh. doing your mom, doing Hi. your mom. Hi, Booty. Hi, homie. How are you? What up? I'm good. What, How are you? What up? Good, what up? Oh, you know, man, I'm just, can you relate? My butthole just hurts, man. Does I it really? anyone else. Uh, I, you know, can you relate? I'm just trying I, to be relatable. Oh, your butthole doesn't actually hurt. No, it's on fire, bro. Really? Yes. I don't believe it you. is. It is a Johnny Cash song down there. Oh, <gasps> it's a. Oh my God! I hurt myself today. That's right. That's right. Okay, so I have the full <laughs> first product here. I guess I'll just ask you. Can you tell me who the first product is from? 
Uh, yeah. So this is a this is a product from the Nelk Boys. Uh, uh, the Nelk for... Boys. Yeah. Oh, yeah. the Nelk so, uh... Boys. Like, like, is that okay? Wait, this is gonna sound really stupid. Is that Steve? Uh, is there someone uh, named Steve in the Nelk Boys? Uh, I no, I maybe, but not a part of who made this. Okay. Maybe was. Maybe who was. Who are the Nelk Boys? Let's look this up. Okay, uh, so that's so... A... go ahead. Go ahead. Oh no, I, I was just gonna say they have a they have a full send podcast, uh, and this was created in 2021, so it's a, a little recent. Uh, <laughs> a but... little recent. Okay, mm -hmm. um, that's what I need from you. If I have questions, I'll ask you. Okay, booty. Yeah, yeah. All right, here we go, chat. We have our first product, the Nelk Boys Happy Dad Seltzer Review. You know what I'll do? We're going to do this. Uh, we leave green, we'll leave the green screen down, and we'll go to this scene so you guys can get the full... Hey! All right. Is your butt burning? My butthole is burning. I've never... Wow. I have never seen a Nelk Boys video. Uh, this is the Nelk Boys what we corrupted an Amish person? Okay, hold on. What? What are they? Where are we, man? Tomorrow, we're going to be meeting up with, like, an Amish family. It's highly disrespectful. They don't like cameras at all. Miami? <laughs> or not. Never thought of that. Oh, yeah. hey! oh, they're drinking it! They're drinking it in the video! Hold your seat, bro. That's that casual. What? Nelk is just racism for high schoolers? I don't know anything about Nelk, but I do know that they released a product called Happy Dad Seltzer. I don't like seltzer at all. I don't, I, I'm sorry, I'm not a big fan, but we're gonna try it. They're just racist. Chat, I, listen, I can't trust anything you say because if I was brought up in another chat, you would probably say the same about me, you know, and you would be correct. All right, about us. Happy have Dad so Seltzer many more, cool. more racist and more awful people's things ahead of us, so sit tight. Wait, really? <laughs> I don't, by the way, chat, I have been made blind to all of this. I didn't want to know. I didn't want to look. I wanted to go in blind. Okay, Happy Dad Hard Seltzer was founded in June 20, wait, how could it be more racist? June 2021 by Sam <laughs> Shahidi. Shahidi, John, Shahidi, and Kyle, four geared, full send podcast. Okay, gotcha. And operates out of Orange County. Yo, shouts out! We're my Orange County boys, better than LA. Um, uh, happy Dad is enjoyed out of regular can because we're tired of the skinny can bullshit. That lib shit, bro. I'm sick and tired of the skinny lib trans can bullshit, bro. Amen. Uh, okay, whatever. It's got a happy dad. All right, we have... Oh, wait, what? Booty, did you did you cross off and put mom on this? No. So I was very confused on that, too. At first, when I got them, I what? thought that it was, like, leftover from Mother's Day. Uh, but it is specifically the raspberry flavor that I bought that is the happy mom. It's this still happy dad. It looks like it's on there with Sharpie. I, I will it, say that is kind of cool. I like that. It, it really fun. does. The box also has it, too. It's fun. That is fun. I, I, it looks so much like someone just took a Sharpie to it. I kind of, I think that's fun. And it's a bit sexist too, which is cool. Girls oh, yeah. like fruity drinks. I like that. Uh, if you, so at the website you're on, if you click home, yeah. you could get a lineup of all their flavors as well. Okay. Let's look. I, I don't like, I like raspberry. So I'll, I'll be the woman here and, oh yeah, look, it's on the website chat. All right. We got, we got a uh, banana. Who the bananas on the left. You can't see it's cut off, but who? drink a banana seltzer bro ain't is this all one flavor booty oh yeah it is yes fix your hair eat my balls uh fruit punch that actually sounds good death row records grape that's odd uh wild cherry we got the raspberry we're gonna try lemon lime i'm sorry I, anyone who tries the banana flavor is unhinged uh okay i'm gonna try it now again chat maybe i i'm just gonna there, we weren't paid by any of these people. I owe nothing to any of these people. Uh, yeah, the, doesn't the grape one seem a little racist? Uh, so I'm just going to try it. No music. I'll let the highlight editors have fun with that. Here we go. And I'm going to be harsh. What's in here? 100 calories. No protein. This isn't going to help me. Your shirt's inside out? Thanks. I'll take care of it in a second. Oh, Wubby, I know you, you always wonder before you drink a new beverage. Uh, you're yeah. wondering, is it kosher? It, it is kosher. So you, you're Oh, safe. thank you're you. Good. Oh, Lachayim. Yeah. <clears throat> no, no We Shot music. Oh, God. Nope. 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 
No, no, that's nothing. That's that's not good. I don't like that at all. I gave nope. you a glass too to see what color it is when you pour it out because I was curious. Is it clear? Did they add? Let's a, find out. Like it's color uh, to well, it. It's five percent alcohol for those wondering. Uh, it doesn't taste like. I'll be honest. It's not that it tastes like alcohol. In fact, I kind of would rather it taste like alcohol. It tastes like um, like Lacroix, and I hate that. Oh, it's not good. Seltzer's always clear. Yeah, I mean, you can still show it though. I'm gonna try it again. It's not good. It's not good. No, I'm sorry, but I, 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 I'll be real. I respect them for like going into a market that I think is already pretty locked down. But I would rather have a Truly or a White Claw, like hands down. I think. I think hands down, I would have either one of those, and I don't even really like either of those very much. Uh, yeah, no. I'm going to give it a thumbs up. Okay, can I guess the price now? What is this, uh, Yeah, so I, I forget how many were in that. What's the 12. box say? Oh, it's a 12-pack. Uh, okay, so uh, what do you think the price was for that entire 12-pack? Um, I don't know how much seltzers go for. Okay, let's do break it down by can. So if it's, well, if it's 12 in there, I don't think these things are less than a dollar a can. I would say I, I wouldn't pay more than two dollars a can so 24 dollars but it's youtuber merch actually i just realized but it's youtuber stuff so that has to add a price to it so i'm gonna say 20 no i'm gonna say 31 dollars wow uh you know i'd say i'd say let's give you within a five dollar range just okay. to, just to be safe you know because it's a lot of numbers out there uh at 31 dollars you are Twelve dollars over. Uh, what? Eighteen ninety nine for the twelve pack. What? That's kind of impressive. He's too rich. I love that. That's where you're gonna go because you're kind of brain dead. I just said I don't buy seltzer drinks, so I actually have no. I genuinely have no clue how much these would cost, and that's a really, really good price for a YouTuber made seltzer. Like yeah. pretty. What boo do you drink more stuff like this? I would, or at least you probably know more. Is that a good price? Honestly, that's a price, and it it contends with things like White Claws or Trulies or any other kind of like hard seltzer. I mean, it puts it right in there uh, with yeah. those. So it's a price. Oh, I didn't like it at all. I would not recommend it. There was a, a Happy Mom or Happy Dad. Okay, Booty, do we have another one? What's up next? Uh, yeah. So uh, let me uh, let me go Come bring on in. you in the second here. I'm gonna go. I will and, have uh, music. You know what? Copy Sorry, Peanut Carlos. I want some Wii Shop music, or at least during the in-betweens. But it sucks. Oh, yeah, but it's gross. I would not recommend it at all. Oh, God, no. Oh, God, no. But you know what? I think, I think, I don't know who it's for. It's not strong enough to get me out of bed, and it's not flavorful enough to make me want to drink it over something else. Hello? Nobody's there. I'm just looking at a door. That was embarrassing. Can you even hear the music? All it Why does Wubby Skateboard have a mic, too? Well, in case he needs to speak, what if he needs to speak? I like the can design. I do too. I like Happy Dad and I like the Cross Dad Happy Mom. Booty's here. So the next one I thought would be helpful for the future boxes that you have. So there's your next one. What the f- Whoa! Oh, I see what you got. I see. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, okay, this is exciting. Hold on, I gotta- This- Dude, this is gonna be fun. Um... Oh, no, he has an- Is it kosher thing? So here we have the binging with babish, or if you, I, I used to say it like binging with babish. Uh, the bi let me turn this down. It's a little loud. The binging with babish knife, chef's knife. Stand now, okay, this is kind of cool. And he said this could be useful. Why did he make a knife? That is absurd. You know, do you think he actually uses this? I feel like you know, he's got a. Oh, go ahead. <laughs> Oh, please. No, sorry. I was going to say it's probably like Gordon, right? What do you mean? Like Gordon has his own cookware that he's like, I only use this. But you know he does it. Like, you know he's got a $300 knife that he's actually using when the cameras aren't running. Right? How much was it? Oh, I guess I have to guess. I'm stupid. Okay, hold yeah. on. I have no idea. He's a chef. No, but I mean, like, does, don't, don't like acclaimed chefs have like top of the line shit. I don't know how much expensive knives are. Oh, I'm okay. I gotta say, I've never had any kind of expensive cookware or like prep anything. This is this looks very cool to me. 
I have no clue. Ooh, oh, bro, this looks so nice. It's got the little, I don't know if you guys can see, it's got a little Babish stamp on it. See that right there? Oh, fuck yes. All right. Okay. Okay. Who? Okay. Careful. Don't be regarded. Here, I'll hold it like I'm supposed to. Okay. Chat, come at me. See what happens. Let's see if how it cuts. We need. To, okay. Bring HP in here. Do a trick. All right. I'm gonna throw it in the air. <laughs> be careful. It's very sharp. This is. A, wait. Do I have any paper though? I do have some. I can paper. bring paper if you need. Could you bring paper? I. Th I want to see how it cuts paper. Yeah. And I also let's see how it cuts my wrist rest. Well, we'll first do the paper cut. Yeah, does anyone have any chicken cutlets? <laughs> this I will say right out the gate. Um Oh, it's look at this. Look at this. Look at that. What's that say there, chat? Come on. Come on, folks. It's got nothing to grab onto to focus. Come on. German steel. Look at that. Look at that German steel. Fact new. I will say this, uh, l yes, booty. Thank you. I don't know anything about knives. I don't even know what a nice knife goes for. I think my knives were like 50 bucks for a set. Uh, look at the bottom of, oh, chat. This is a dangerous hold here, but I'm going to, I'm going to pull it off. Now this, I, I mean, if you're a fan of him, this is cool. I think this is so cool. All right, let's see how sharp it is. Although, I don't know what that matters, because you can sharpen even a piece of shit knife. It's about how long it holds its blade. How do you even... Fuck, I'm, like, nervous. I think you could just drop the paper over the knife. No. What? Do you... No. What? I mean, this seems pretty sharp. At... Dude, you're so stupid for that. <laughs> Pity, I don't know if you saw it. didn't work at all. <laughs> I saw the delay. All right, all right. I think um, you can still hold it as you drop it down. This, okay, this is cardboard. I'm not gonna, I don't wanna push hard and lose control and stab myself and kill myself. Um, It's very sharp. I mean, it's it's insanely sharp. I also don't know anything about chef's knives, but I love the way this feels. Everything feels quality. Um, it, it, I mean, if you're a fan of him, this is legit, I would say. I don't know if anybody knows, let me see if there's anything about the steel and let's see if Chad can help me determine how much this is. Okay. Uh, crafted from high carbon, forged and tempered German steel, double bolstered handle, seamless ABS grip secures full tang blade. I'm not going to look at chat because I bet they're putting the price at this point. From what I'm reading here, though, I mean, this thing seems legit. This looks like a legit knife. And I think someone like Beb Bebish, who is a legitimate chef and has made an entire career out of being a chef, I think he would not put out a subpar product. You know, if I'm not trying to be rude or anything, but like, I don't know, if Cold Ones put out a knife, I feel like it would serve more as a as a fun piece rather than an actual useful tool. But if Babish is going to put out a knife, like, it's like if I put out, um, I don't, let me think of an example. I don't know. If I put out, I got nothing. I'm not passionate about anything. A fidget I toy? Think, a f what'd you say? A fidget toy? <laughs> Why, why are you leave me alone? I'm gonna say I might be stupid for this. Maybe I am. I'm gonna say this is a I'll just tell the chat right now. I'm between $150 or $80. I guess I'll split the difference. I'm gonna say this is a hundred dollar knife. Okay. Locking in at a hundred. I'm locking in at a hundred. I mean it's really nice. It is really nice, and so I think that's why you would be shocked to hear this knife costs, for an 8-inch chef knife, only $22.98. You can actually get all three of his knives. Uh, he has the 8-inch chef knife, there's a, a, a clef, a cleaver, and a chef knife, and a, a, like a, a santoku knife. All three of those what? for under $70. Okay, now now... Wow. Well, first off, I know people in chat are going, some people are making fun of me, but there's also a fair amount of you that are shocked. What? I mean, I don't I, know I, nothing I, about knives, but I kind of don't like that it's so cheap. 
I, I'm genuinely impressed at how nice it looks. For the price, I was expecting it to be very gimmicky. And no, it's I'm, not. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it I mean, it, there's, there has to be something compromised at that price. And I'm going to go out on a limb here and say the materials are probably the compromising part. But I'll say, I mean, if you like binging with Babish, I, why not? This is, it looks, I mean, it's decent. 22 bucks. That's like less than a shirt for most YouTubers. 4116 is not great steel. Oh, yeah, that said the steel on there. Okay. I was way off, booty. Yeah, little, just a little bit, but I mean, I think that that's just kind of a show of like it looks nice. <laughs> yeah, you know what? It, it, and that's fair. All right, I'm ready for the next one. All right, I'm gonna copy and paste these in here for you real Thank fast, you. and Thank then I'll you. be right inside. He's able to use it in all his videos, so it's a super smart right, product. Right oh, he's a genius for it. That's that's. I mean, yeah, I agree. Um, is this the video? What is this? Oh wait. Um. Uh, okay. Okay. Booty has the next one coming. In. It's more about how you sharpen it anyway. No. No. I know that. I know a little bit about knives, like this much. And let me tell me if I'm wrong, chat. Thank you, Booty. Tell me if I'm wrong. Knife quality comes down to if you know how to sharpen your knife well, how long the blade stays in that position. Because you can. I saw. I've seen YouTube videos. A dude sharpened a piece of chocolate, right? And he made it razor sharp. But that doesn't matter because the stronger the steel, the more it'll hold that blade without chipping or or getting. You know, is that correct? So, okay, I'm ready. So, uh, in our DMs, yes. if you want to watch the first YouTube video, this? that'll give a, that's or the, give a nice introduction. The, top, the one? One, top one? Okay. That'll give you a nice introduction. Uh, it's timestamp. Should I be watching? Yes, okay, so just watch that. Up to your <laughs> oh my god, this is so stupid. <laughs> okay, I'll just watch this right now. All right, we have a video that Booty has uh, grabbed. It's next to me? Okay. All right, here we go. Here. <laughs> no way, bro. And if you can see, there's a little bitty try me. So let's take it on the box. Bro, I've been waiting to try Addison Ray. Are you kidding me? I've been waiting. Let's see what that is. And here it is. I'm so excited about this one. Like it's on the box, there is a try me. So let's see what that does. Oh my god, this is terrible. It from from she's 11. Okay, then I'm 11. Bro, I will say it does kind of look like a version of her that has down syndrome, which is interesting. <laughs> I really, really love this outfit. We have so many it's of those dolls in the house now. <laughs> this coat is so now, Booty. Is the price going to appear in this, or, or, or am I safe? Uh, Do you I know? hope not. I don't believe so. This is an older product um, that I okay. I don't know if it's available many places anymore. How did we get, bro? It's next to me right now. How did we do this? <laughs> Okay, I'll look at it in a second. You know, I'm not going to let her go over the rest of it. I'm just going to go through it myself. So here we have... This is surreal that it's right here in front of me. We have, Let me zoom out a little bit. We have here the... The Addison Rae Deluxe Music Doll. Got it. Really? I feel like they used a photo of her on the box that looks more like the doll. But I don't think she looks like the doll in real life. Okay, let's try her. You guys ready? Man, it, it almost sounds better than the than the advertising video. Can we do let's do a side by side? Um she's 16. Is she actually I thought she was in her twenties. If she's in her if she's 16, then I'm kidding. I mean, so let's see what that does. <laughs> it's it's like it's like a version of the song from hell do i open this fuck yes i do we're not gonna absolutely keep it mint. we're not gonna and keep you have it a perfectly mint. good tool here, to open it okay i'm gonna let's see how we can do this without hurting myself use the knife to carve off her head like an isis video and yell la 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 <laughs> get out of your cave bitch i'm freeing her i'm freeing you addison Okay, she's strapped in pretty good. Also, I'm already starting to see a few issues. Wait, how did I get to this scene? I'm, I'm starting to see a few issues with uh, 
this knife, it's having a hard time cutting through plastic. And I don't think that the knife is advertised that I can't cut through plastic. So there's an issue there. God, she's really strapped into this thing, huh? This is doing it for someone. Wait, how old is she again? Fuck, I'm, I don't, Addison Ray's an adult. Booty, how old's Addison Ray? Uh, why'd uh, you mute? What, what? She's 22, she's 22. Okay, let's, um, well, here she is in, um, <laughs> hold on, let me play this. God, she's, her beauty is unmatched. Okay, just checking. I don't know, sorry. I, you know, everyone's gotta start somewhere. <laughs> you know, did they give her toes? I mean, you bought the doll. You can play with it however you like, I think, right? <laughs> I did buy the doll, and I am going to play with it how I want to play. She's 16 in this video? Okay, but how old's the doll? You know? Damn, she built Ford Tough! Not tough enough. <laughs> so, just to be clear... Babish in his GQ video didn't even plug his knife. He said he uses a $150 knife from Japan. Told you. See? There you go. So... The head is not supposed to come off. Um, it, it has broken off. I love that my autofocus likes her head. It is not supposed to come off. There is a small piece floating around in there. Uh, let's see what else we can do here. It looks like her... She's stra her coat is strapped on using plastic. Got that. Oh, this is... See, this is what they don't want you to do. This is... Um, she's sewn in. So it's it's all or nothing here. So, you know, I mean, obviously. <clears throat> I think this is what Babish would have wanted. Let him it cook. is sharp. Let huh? him cook. Let him cook. I'm just looking at the quality of the doll, you idiots. They gave her a belly button. Bobby, please oh. be careful with the knife. It won't cut plastic, but it will cut you. Okay, so fish. fact, Ted Bundy also decapitated his victims. I'm uh, not a victim. Zip. I like that the speaker is a little hard. Just to young Elderberry, she loves everybody, and also <laughs> Burple Brink is kind of cool. Okay, that's a little cringe what you just did, but that's fine. So she, stop saying thick, stop saying no nipples. Someone in chat said she kind of fat. Okay, this is, you are giving women body dysmorphia. Look, you press her little navel. Um, yeah, this is a piece of shit. This is a huge piece of shit. Wait, there's a, there's a. Try me and there's a play mode. Here we go, Wait chat. Time to start my stab myself. Any percent speed run. I'm not going to stab myself. There's two modes. I just put her into play mode. Is it just a longer version? It just doesn't stop. Wait, really? Oh, I don't know. Can you please switch her to lie down and take it mode, please? Stop! What I said wasn't cringe. You in a wheelchair to stand up and buy a medallion was cringe and I love you though, so we good. I mean, I'm having fun, I think. She even- Oh my god, she- Oh no. She comes with content creator accessories, bro. Oh no. That's a ring, dude, that is a ring light that you would mount your phone to. Fuck off with this, this is terrible. Um, okay, so I think what's worse is if I, oh, I'm talking into her like she's a mic. Um, I think what would be worse about this is if I knew how much something like this costs. Um, I have no clue, I've never purchased a little girl's doll. Uh, but I'm gonna guess, Addison Ray. it's dog shit. It's probably uh, way more than a Barbie because there's no way this could be like mass produced. So what is a Barbie going for? Like 15, 20 bucks? I'm going to say this is, who is this for? Who is this like, who is this for? I'm going to say $25.99 booty. Okay. Okay. Well, the Addison Ray fashion doll. Uh, it still is available on the website. I put the link to their website, and it's very broken and very funny. 
Uh, but currently, uh, we bought this for $13.44. What? What? Wait, really? Yeah. The third that is so cheap i kind of respect these prices this I is mean, this is the cheapest item that we have kind of whoa. per item in a way how much is a barbie that's uh, the real question uh, explains the quality i, I Margo mean margot robbie has merch okay how much is a a non margot robbie barbie 40 dollars for a really what also girl you gotta play with cooler things what do you do with a doll at least my action figures like save towns and fly. What does she do? Oh, I'm, I'm on my period. <laughs> Kidding. All right. Booty, we're ready for the... You play? I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm ready for the next one. I'm ready. All right. I'll I'm be joking. right in. Thank you. She drives to the mall and does drama. That's fucking funny. Now that right there is harassment. Okay. We'll harass this dick. What am I... Who am I harassing? I'm playing... Uh, who's to tell me I can't play with it all how I want to play with it all? Booty, can you bring a jar? That's a joke. Give her a haircut. I don't want to hurt myself. I don't want to cut myself in the process. Is this a threat? Who am I threatening? Let's see if I can chuck her use it like this. That was fun. I kind of like the knife early. The knife early was a good call. I can I can play with things. Incel arc? <laughs> you mean incel career? Uh, I'm voluntarily sell. Okay. <laughs> Isis arc. I also had a Bratz doll. My sister would bully me for them. I uh, remember there was these twins in middle school and they invited everyone in the class to cosmic bowling. And I was friends with the boy twin, but I wasn't friends with the girl twin. And I got them. Uh... All right, this, this one's going to require some setup. Okay. So I have a bunch of things here for you. Okay, you can just set them down. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep, I'm going to tell a story. Oh, yeah. And so uh, the the I got the guy I forget what I got him but it was a, it was a big hit I got him something I think I got him like a bionicle or something uh, the girl I didn't know what to get a girl and my dad was no help there and we don't we he doesn't we don't have he didn't have daughters or nothing so I got the girl some Bratz dolls and this memory has lived with me since then I remember her opening the Bratz dolls she looked confused she then looked at her mom her mom kind of nudged her she looked at me. She awkwardly said, um, thank you. And then I walked away and continued bowling. I have a, that has lived with me forever. And when I think of Bratz dolls, when I think of anything, it makes me cringe. It makes me die. And I never understood. I never under, I was like, I always thought, was she too old for them? Does she not like Bratz dolls? Was she, yeah, was she uncultured? Was she a whore? Okay, uh, should I? Oh, you can attach the doll to your mic. I can attach the doll to my mic with this. Well, uh, thank you, Booty. So here's your next item. Yeah. And all of these things, uh, I'll, I'll, we can talk in the call, but this okay. uh, is an enhancement. It's an enhance. Okay, thank you. And I left the website for you to look at. Okay, thank you. I'm gonna have her. How do I strap her in? This is getting dark. I will say it was. It was funny at first, but it. it what could I say? I don't know what the hell little second best twin girls like at that age. Okay, I guess I just is it like this. This is kind of a compromising position. Okay, well, I, maybe I can get her. Maybe I can. Yo, yeah. Let's see if I, maybe if I put it like, yeah, maybe if I, maybe if I put it like, like this, and it goes like. like, like. All right, come on, Addison. You want to make it in this town? You got to work with me. Come on. All right. Next YouTuber product here. Um, we this one's have a fun one. Oral Sex Demon. Also, Burple does love you. Thank you. Let me get Addison Ray off the screen here. We have... Okay. Pizzafy. Turn anything into pizza. I don't know what this is or who sells this. Made with vine ripe tomatoes from Cal California. Seriously, it's so good you'll want it on everything. Okay. What? Has anyone even heard of this? Uh, this also, is Arak. This is Arak's uh, Pizza Fi. I've never even heard of this. 
Okay, let me scroll down. And let's let's. Oops, sorry, wrong scene, folks. Um, pizzafy that hashtag. Oh, he wants it. Okay, what? Is it just? I'm sorry. Is this just pizza sauce? <laughs> so it's a. It, they consider it a pizza flavored condiment topping. So I don't think it's just sauce. I think it also has seasonings and spices. And uh, it's supposed to be able, there's, I didn't link them because they're all, I'm gonna, they're a little cringe, but there's a lot of shorts and TikToks of people just being like, this turns anything into pizza. Let's see if this will turn into pizza. Uh, I, I, so I, people... I'm sorry, but I, maybe, chat, maybe I'm missing something. Maybe, I, I don't know. I've never thought, oh, these French fries are so delicious. I wish they tasted like pizza. Now I want to be, I like like marinara. Oh, you guys can't see. I'm sorry. I like marinara sauce. I need to make, hold on. I got to make my screen the proper size here because it's doing the ultra wide thing. Give me a second here, chat. Give me a second. It's like fat kid shit. No, it's not. I'm a fat kid. It's not fat kid shit. That's the, I, I don't, I've never wanted this. And I'm a fat kid. Fun fish fact. Hey son, did you ever I find the I feel like it's for the person zip? who is like, I wish I could have this pizza lunchable sauce on everything. <laughs> no, no, hold on, but I gotta mess with you. Hold on. Okay, I'm gonna continue now. Is it kosher, booty? I need to know. Is it kosher? Uh, yeah, uh, yeah. All right, let's that take one a actually it didn't list if it was. Let me check it. Introducing dippable. What did we get here? I guess I'll just open it. I'll stop wasting time. All right, be your own boss. <clears throat> Okay, there is a label on here. There is a label on the bottom that I'm not going to show you guys. So here, be your own box. God, Addison, get it together. Rough night, huh? This is kind of a cute box. Open to turn anything into pizza. I'll be the judge of that. Booty has brought a really disappointing range of food. I think this would be good on fries. Um, I don't think this will be good on what Booty brought in, which I, I cannot believe these are the fixings that he's brought in. So uh, I, I tried to do things that weren't listed on their yeah, website. I because see, it's already, I see that. <laughs> it's already confirmed that those will turn into pizza. So I want I was curious to see what else would be turned into pizza. Okay. This is a cute, like, I mean, I like this packaging. I actually like it a lot. This is fun. I love getting packaging that's like novel to the product. And this is cute. I'm not going to lie. I'm not a fan of Air Rack at all. Just to be clear, I don't watch his videos. I'm not anti Air Rack or anything. I just, I don't watch his videos. Um, so I'm just being genuine. I also kind of, I think Alex will like this too. I kind of love the packaging of this. This is fun. I love it. His name's Iraq. Yeah. I hate Iraq. No, this is kind of fun. I don't like the color of the sauce, but the packaging is nice. All right. I'm going to open up and smell it. Will be goes to Iraq. Oh, okay. Hold on. Hold on. This immediate red flag, immediate red flag. This is brand new. It expires in 2025. I'm opening up the bottle. Look at this. Opening up the bottle, and it's clearly disgusting already. Has the seal been broken on this? Absolutely. Absolutely, the seal has been broken or compromised. I will not be eating any of this bottle. Pizza fry the pop tarts behind you, please. Please. And, and you can't say that you got an old bottle because um, these this expires in years. This expires in years. So, and it even says refrigerate after opening. I'm gonna check this one now. Okay, this one looks much better, much more sealed even. Okay, this one looks good. This one looks really good actually i think that i i think i should try this one what do you guys think i think that's sealed i think that looks pretty okay this one is that's that's already really really negative review that i know that this happens i know that this is unfortunate i know that shit happens and that's reality of shipping products but unfortunately the one i'm reviewing half of them were destroyed so I'm going to squeeze to show you this is pretty sealed. I'm going to crack the seal now. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yep, that was sealed. Oh, yeah. And I mean, you can't. I'm sorry, but when it comes to food products, like 
Especially when I'm sure a lot of kids are going to be getting this. Uh, that That's not acceptable. Bro, bro, it's Pepper. Please don't ban. Burple loves you. Love Botulism you in a bottle. Yum, yum. <laughs> For real, though. Okay. Um, Nice hiss. We have some <laughs> options here. First off, absolutely goaded snack. When Booty brought these in, I'm like, what? Are YouTubers making these? Actually goaded. I'm going to try it. Now, I don't know what you could put on to... um. A chicken in a biscuit to make it gross. I don't know what you could put onto it to make it gross. Um, oh, Addison, sweetheart, I'm sorry. I forgot all about you. Oh, I forgot all about you. Um, so I think this is just going to taste good because I don't know what you could put on here that wouldn't be good. So here I go. Let's get this on a tray. Let's get this out onto a tray. Nice. <clears throat> I love chicken and a biscuit. All right, here we go. This is so novel. I cannot believe they like actually created this product. All right, whatever. Three, two, one. Okay. L okay, listen. Listen. Listen, I guess I guess the thing about this that I'm confused about is it's good. It tastes like pizza sauce. Why don't I just go to I, Vons or, or or I don't know whatever local grocery you guys have and just get some pizza sauce? What's different? I think like I'm, I think the novelty of the squeeze top because if you get pizza sauce it's usually in a jar. So, like, maybe you have to put but it in the, something okay. to dip, or... I, I, I mean, I guess. I, but it, what's... Now, Booty, I, I ask you a question. You don't tell me the price, but... Did you get this at a grocery store? I saw the packaging. Mm -hmm. Or did this have to be shipped? Uh, this had to be shipped. I ordered this from their website directly. Okay. So, with that in mind, chat... No, fuck that. I'm gonna go drive or Instacart sauce. Like, fuck that. That is not worth the squeeze top novelty at all. But I'm going to try it on some other products here. We have, he brought this in, a sus bar from Gamer Subs, which I actually love these. I never advertise them because I don't want you guys to think I'm a total sellout, but I love sus bars. These are like protein bars almost in flavor. They're sugary, like not actually, there's not sugar, but they are sweet. Um, so this is going to be gross. So here we go. Um, <laughs> Sus bars are expensive. Oh, they're totally expensive, but they're delicious. I love them. Like, legitimately, I do love them. This is going to be I'm disgusting. not paid by them, and I love them. Yes, I, I am paid by them, and I never promote them because I don't want people to think I'm a total sellout, but I love them. All right, this is going to be gross. Oh, my God, that tasted very, like, very... Very, very similar to vomit. Oh, oh God. Oh my God. That tastes like the way vomit. Why are you guys so tiny? Why, how'd you guys get so small? Why don't you guys tell me you were so tiny? Chat. Oh God. Okay, what else? No, I'm not doing this, Booty. Tell you, Bo tell, no, that's okay because uh, I, we, I gave you the pizza sauce uh, because uh, we have a few more food items coming up. Okay. So you don't have okay, to waste all your that. appetite on these right now. I just gave Let you me, some options. I'll try the other thing that you brought that I think is the only fair one. Pringles. Yeah. You brought me uh, Scorch and Pringles. You know what? I'm, I'm okay. I'm starting to see the novelty a little bit. I'll try it on this Scorch and Pringle, which I love. I love me some Scorch and Pringles. Ooh, ooh, sweetheart, no! Get up there. All right, here we go. Yeah, I mean... <clears throat> ooh. Yeah, yeah. Like, it's good. Yeah, it's good. You know what? I like... I like the taste. I like the flavor. I, uh... I'm, I'm okay with this. Um... I think it's gonna come down to price. This has to be like as cheap than the competitors for me to even consider it. 
So to put it in perspective, uh, I ordered from their website. I'm not including things like taxes or shipping into the that's equation because I think that's, that's unfair. So this is just the base price on the website, and it was that package, and it comes in a two pack. So the two pack is the only option. So you have to buy two of them. Um, okay. <sighs> and you got to think this is a YouTuber. This isn't like you know st stuff you'd grab off the. Sh this ain't Prego. Um. I'm gonna say. I mean, I, maybe I, I need to start being more reasonable here. I keep thinking everything's super inflated. I'm going to say $8.99. I'm going to say $8.99 for two. Okay. And I think uh, anything above that, you need to just go to the store and buy your own. I'm sorry. Well, Wubby, uh, this is the first time you've guessed too low. Uh, this, would you believe, is so far the most expensive thing you have looked no, at. No, it is not. That is highway <laughs> robbery, bro. No, for it is not. Two bottles and the packaging, I guess. It was $24.99. No, okay, no, Eric, no. That is that is criminal, Eric. That is criminal, brother. No way. So first off, $24.99. One of mine was botulismed out of its skull. Okay, $12 a bottle? No, I you could calculate the pennies on each bite. Now I don't I'm I'm I this is the this is the first one that I think I legitimately going to say do not purchase this. Is that's before shipping, Booty? That was before shipping, yeah. No. No. Thankfully, no, I think they were in California so it wasn't too bad, but this tastes good. The novelty of this thing is fun. Uh the the spray, but no, I'm gonna I'm gonna drive my ass down to Vaughn's or, or or Albertsons or Ralph's or Costco, and I'm gonna get an entire grocery cart of groceries for twenty four ninety nine. Sorry, no, no. It would be cheaper to get a giant pizza, take the cheese off, scrape the sauce into a bottle, and just throw away everything else. <laughs> I I mean, yeah, that's that is. See, I like something like this. If Airac was doing like a limit, like, hey guys, limited time run. It's 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 this price because it's limited. You're supporting the channel. Three weeks only. We're doing a cool run. Get a bottle now. I can understand that. This looks like it's a like I'm on the site still. This is a product you can buy right now, and that's where it's like, dude, no, 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 no. This isn't a business. No way. Who asked? My brother in Christ, you're watching stream. All right, I'm ready for the next one, booty. Cool. Uh, let and, me mute and I'll be ready. An entire card at Costco for twenty four ninety nine. Who said Costco? I really want you to get up, walk in the mirror, look yourself in the eyes, and just ask yourself before speaking next time if what you're saying brings anything to the table. Like, just go get up, look yourself in the mirror. You did. I'm gonna get up and go ask myself, Ryan. I'm gonna. I'll be right back. I'm gonna get up and go ask myself. I'm gonna look in the mirror and I'm gonna ask myself if I bring anything to the table. I'll be right back. Okay. No. Okay. I, I, this one annoys me, I think, more than anything else. I prefer the Addison Ray doll to this. Hey, like, this is so this is so frustrating to me. This is a... I, I, I hope you understand what... You're a boy. You're a boy. Why don't you go live, you dipshit? It's Lunchable sauce. That is the closest thing it tastes like. It tastes like uh, the, the sauce you get on the pizza Lunchables. Maybe a little better. Yo. Oh, no. Okay. These to set up for now. Oh, okay. Milk. We have oat milk. Well, this is just from my house. Uh, so the link that I sent you, um, okay. I don't know the order you want to look in if you want to see this first, but I sent you a link that is one of the funniest Amazon reviews, I think. Okay. I'll look at the Amazon review right now. So this is also, uh, this is, this product you cannot buy. I had to buy this on eBay. So. No, that's not good. And the title of this post is Rectal Bleeding. Okay, well, uh, got a call from the school nurse. She stated my daughter was in her office complaining of blood in her poop, picked her up and investigated, found her pink poop was from this cereal. Other than the rectal bleeding scare, it's not bad. Enjoy. Oh, this is a positive review. Oh, I see. Okay, so that's as they love it. Four stars. Four stars. They love it. It tastes great. It tastes great. All right. Um, who is this by? I guess I'll just look. <laughs> oh, boy. The discontinued. The poop accelerates. 
Wubby tries another disgusting thing and ends up on the toilet again. The poop accelerates. Okay. We have the Jojo Siwa Strawberry Bop. Strawberry Bop cereal. When did this expire? Uh, earlier this, this year, I believe. Do I have to eat this? <laughs> this well, is a, it's expired, booty. Oh, it's, it's, um... It expired like five months ago. It did. I don't think they've sold this cereal for a couple years. Her legs look so wrong. They look very weird here. It's matured. I don't think I want to eat this, but I will. All right. Who, who, who? It says best before. No, it says best if used by. <laughs> um, I'm going to just uh, give it a try. Let's take a look. Oh, the bag is very puffy. I don't... <laughs> I, I, on second thought, I don't think I'm going to try it. This bag is, uh, is, is, that's normal. I don't know if it's normal. What? This looks pretty appetizing, actually. That is neon. <laughs> that looks delicious. I'll try it. They just look like a... It's only bad if it's Just chewy. Give was. it a good whiff. Wow! Wow! This smells unhealthy. Like it smells like dessert. How much sugar is in it? Uh oh! Hoo -hoo! One and a fourth cup is thirty-four grams. Oh no! I'm sorry. Oh so oh, no 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 sorry. That's carbs. Uh uh, twelve grams. Woo. Oh! <laughs> God. Damn. Someone else in this house needs to try it with me. I'm not going to die alone. I'll just... Okay, I'm going to go for the marshmallow first. Luke. Wubby, nothing you eat is going to stay in you for long anyway. That's true. I'm just going to eat it. Fuck it. I'll just try it. Right? Why not? Just try it. I'm just going to try it. Should I try it? Yeah. Okay, this shit's good as fuck. <laughs> Honestly, I kind of was excited because one of my favorite things, like, I was hoping the cereal would turn the milk into, like, strawberry milk. I feel like that would probably be the best thing. How do you think it'll be as a pizza? How do I think it'll be as a pizza? I'm going to find out right now. Okay. Let's do this. I need, like, a clean line here. Oh yeah, little little do little doppels on every piece. All right, here we go. Pizza Jojo Siwa. <clears throat> why you're asking me why I do it? Because if I didn't, you call me a pussy. Ugh, <sighs> God. Not anything with the pizza sauce that's sweet turns into shit. And then I washed it down with the seltzer. Shit. Okay, guys, this is fucking good. I'm I, I really like Jojo Siwa's marshmallows. These are this is <laughs> fucking delicious, to be completely honest. Okay. There is a there's a surprising amount of these boxes on eBay. Like I said, I had to go to eBay to get this. They don't sell the it pizza in stores anymore. I, it just said discontinued. It wasn't like there was a recall, but Wait, what? pretty much every review or complaint about it is that it really just will stain your toilet bowl. <laughs> yeah, it's good. I like it. Um, I have no clue how much this should cost. So I have I have two numbers. So it is okay. out of stock, but I still I still found a price that it was sold at at, at Walmart. But then uh, I don't know if you want to try and guess that, or if you want to try and guess what you had to pay for it on an okay. eBay listing. I, I, I will I will guess both, but the 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 point will only be for the Walmart price. I think it's gonna be six bucks at Walmart. Six bucks. That seems. I mean, that, I mean, it's JoJo Siwa shit, right? Six mm -hmm. bucks. Yeah. 
Fair, fair. And do you, have, uh, oh. do you want me to tell you that one first? Bro, I don't know how this happened. I spilled it all over my floor. <laughs> how did this happen, dude? When did this... Um, you know what? We'll deal with it later. Go ahead. Uh, so since this one is for the point, I'll tell you that one first. And we could guess on the eBay one after. Wubby, you're correct. This one... <gasps> was found at Walmart, the family size, for $7.72. Okay, that's a lot. Okay, I I'm close enough. You said within five bucks, but that's yeah. an $8 box? Ooh. Is that seems like a lot for me. That seems it like... It was the family size, I guess, but... I, 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 you know, I guess it was. Yeah, whatever. But still, ah, no, nah, you're not getting that shit. Sorry. Vacuum it up. No, no. Okay, I got, okay how much did I pay on eBay for it? Now, how much did we pay on eBay for it? Twenty five ninety nine. Twenty five ninety nine. And I mean, if you paid more, that's coming out of your paycheck. <laughs> fair, fair. I had that very much in mind. Okay. Uh, so uh, this one, it wasn't too bad. This one we got for fourteen dollars and ninety five cents. Oh, okay, that's that's actually reasonable. Damn, you could have made a profit on this JoJo shit if you bought it at the time. That's that's a that's a huge that's a huge profit. All right, I'm ready for the next one, Booty. Thank you. Absolutely, I'll bring it in. Let me mute. <sighs> leave Why it there as an experiment, floor Jojo Siwa. You want me to leave it? There's a lot on the floor, like a lot on the floor. There's probably sixty odd pieces of of it on. I think I put it upside down at one point. There's so much of it is on the floor, guys. Uh, by the way, saw some subs that came in during that. Let me thank you, brother. Um. Uh, Night Market. Thank you for the 25. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. She does. She has. I mean, she. Ugh, ugh. Fuck. The, you know, I'm happy we have the pizza fi because I probably will use this whole bottle. But that's it. That's the last time I'm going to use it. Pizza fly the floor watermelon. No, I don't even want to touch it. I'm eating things. The cats might eat it. I clean it up after stream. Don't worry. It's midnight. That means bedtime. No, we're just getting started. Booty, we have to pick up the pace. I'm hungry for the good stuff. I don't know what's coming. Just refill it with better pizza. Boy, oh, Chad, that's so smart. You can just fill this up with other pizza sauce. It's that easy. It's 5 a.m. here. Don't be a coward. Oh, holy shit, y'all. Uh, uh, oh. Black Mirror, maybe? I need to talk to you guys. Yes, Booty. How many, Booty, how many more do we have? We're about halfway through. Oh, good. Okay. Oh, shit! All right. Now we're cooking. Oh, dang. Okay. This is the uh, Japanese suicide forest ring. All right. <clears throat> I'm excited to try this. You hear about something so much, you get advertised to. They're saying shitty Gatorade. I haven't had it. All right. Well, this is in a can, though. Where's Booty? Booty? Just sat down. Yeah. All right. Prime Energy. Is this Nike Normal Prime? Is this different than Normal Prime? Uh, this is this is uh this is the Logan Paul KSI Prime drink that they they collaborated and yes. crossed over on. So this is just their. I don't. This is their. Not their energy. This is the energy. Ver what, what? Why is this one in a can? Uh. I don't know. So they started selling a bunch of these in cans. Oh, this one is the caffeinated one. I'm sorry. This one has 200 milligrams of caffeine in the 12 ounce oh can. Oh my God. I will have a sip of this. All right, let's look at this. We have created. Uh oh. This was, a, this was their uh, primetime TV company. app. <laughs> the fastest growing sports drink in history. It is kind of crazy how, how big Prime got. Everyone's shit talking it, but like, my God, this company has made them buku dinero, bro. I don't even, I, I've never had it. I don't know anything about it. This season, we are hydrated. The official sports Yeah, when we get to the price, it, it is very weird. Okay. All right. I will try Prime right now. This is, I didn't know they made it in cans. So is this going to be carbonated? I guess it might. Here we go. It's not bad. Well, I'll be the judge. 10 calories. I don't like that there's three carbs in this. Why are you putting carbs in my drinks? No sugars. Okay, here we go. Now, this is I'm going to compare this to Gamer Subs. 
Cause that's that's my sponsor. Actually illegal in my country? What? Okay, nice really? hiss. Is this carbonated? This is carbonated. What the fuck? All right, here we go. That's disgusting. I'm not even lying. I'm not even lying. This is not good. It is very sweet. That is not good. I do not like that. That is really sweet tasting. My God. How is this sugar free? Someone in chat just said it best. It's like liquid candy. I guess that probably works for like the audience they're targeting, like kids. But this is, this is, this is not this. I do not like this. I don't like energy drinks. Oh, hold on. I got some uh, gamer subs on my desk here. Mm. Mm. And it goes down so much better with Code Wubby. That's crazy. No, all jokes, I'm going to be honest. I will give an honest review. If I liked it more than Gamer Subs, I would tell you, I would not have this ever again. Pizza Fi it? <laughs> how, guys? How? 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 Have how? you had Ghost Energy? Is it the same sweet level? Okay, I'll put some on pizza? the... <laughs> we'll find out if it pizzas, guys. Booty, you should have saved the pizza for the end. Well, okay. I, I really liked... See, this. I, I really wanted to give it to you before all these, you know? Oh, that's awesome that you did that. All right, here we go. Does it Pizza Fi? Oh God! Why it doesn't? <laughs> Every time it tastes like vomit, it, I got you don't understand. <laughs> it really tastes like vomit. Well, you will be happy to know that it is gluten free, vegan, soy free, kosher, and my favorite on their on their FAQs on their website, it asks, "Is Prime halal?" <laughs> <laughs> is it? <laughs> They answer, while Prime products do not can do not hold a formal halal certification, our products do not constitute any ingredients or manufacturing processes that would require such certification. So there's, there's a formal yes? ha, there's formal halal. What does that mean? I don't want to know. I, I, All right, they didn't um, get their halal certs. I'm not. I I would not recommend this drink. Sorry, I know this is big. It is way too sweet. I don't know if normal non like energy Prime is is Daddy better. Wub. Know what isn't nasty? Gamer subs, especially when you use code Wubby at checkout. Amen also, Burple. Sorry, Burple. No, Blake I don't want to make this you. like Please a. I'm paid to not like it. You. I I really just don't like it. It's too, it's way like. And I tried it back to back just with with my gamer subs. Um, the sweetness difference is is legitimately like jarring. It's way too much. I don't like it. They have someone coming to the factory to bless it. I'm not kidding. Interesting. Can you try it with the pizza fi again, please? You I'm drinking, I opened a can as well. It. I chilled one, and it is. I agree. It's. It is just like candy. It's. It's. And also, sweet like tarts. this is not what I want to drink when I need energy. I. I want something that feels hydrating. Mm -hmm. This. I don't like sugary tasting things. That's something that a lot of people, when they first tried gamer subs, were like, "G fuel is way too strong." Gamer subs is like watered down, but I want that when I want to hydrate. I don't. That's like God. Tell me if this triggers you or not. When somebody is thirsty and they're so they're parched and they're like, oh, "Give me a can of Coke." It's like, "What?" When I'm when I'm thirsty, I need something that that is not that. I need something thin and light. All right. Oh. I'm going to guess the price, booty. So what it was a So this was a 12 pack of the energy cans. Now, I will say, uh these I bought online. These I had to buy uh I bought these on Amazon because uh trying to find them locally was either i had to drive very far away for a single flavor of a, like mm -hmm. a six pack of like the the bottles or something mm -hmm. um but i will tell you well you guess the price first on these for this 12 pack and then i'll tell you what the weird anomaly is 29.99 12 pack 29.99 all right wubby uh this was actually you got it right this one was 24.99 actually for this 12 pack let's go okay yeah so the, I got this one too because every other one was over forty-five dollars. I am not kidding. They, what? Like a, tw a, a six pack would be like thirty plus dollars. The the other twelve packs are like forty plus dollars. This one was twenty-five, and I'm like, this one has to be the worst flavor or something. I guess I don't know. Well, that's the thing too. I don't dislike the flavor if I'm just talking about like the fruit punch aspect of it. But it's I, I think the sweetness would would be problematic 
in every other flavor. All right, Buddha, I'm ready for the next one. Yeah, absolutely. This one's going to be a fun one, so uh, I'm going to mute my beer. Uh, they are probably making millions off of this shit. And you know what's crazy? It's just, it's not even that good. It's not even that good. I'm going to pizzafy another chicken and a biscuit. I'm, I'm sorry. These are good. Pizzafying chicken and a biscuit kind of goes hard, kind of goes crazy. This is good. I like this. Oh, yeah. Get it all on there. That's good. That's pretty good. Okay, brother. Yeah. So this, uh, I didn't open it, so just make sure that nothing of ours is in there, but we got a complete set of things. I'll tell you when I'm back at my computer. So I sent you links. Okay. Maybe you want to look through a little bit. I don't know, but watch the first video that I just sent you. You didn't send me anything. Ah, fuck. Okay. I'll Thank you. Watch okay. Video. Thank you. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm not going to pizzafy this one. <laughs> this is glow skin enhancement skin management for all different skins is this is this trisha paytas uh okay that's right wubby what you're holding right now is the glow skin enhancement from the asmr skincare line uh uh made by trisha paytas is there a oh it's this oh. so is she's not she on youtube lovingly... Uh, this is the Amazon listing for her own product. I can't show that though. Ah. Oh. Okay. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna this. Okay. Let me make sure there's nothing in here that would dox us. It doesn't look. Oh my god. All right. ASMR skin. Morning. It gives me a whole uh, routine. Trish. Trishy land. Is this? Did this? This had to have gotten recalled. I don't want to. I don't want any product that Trisha Paytas made on my face. I think uh, I don't want to be too mean. Listen, <laughs> I feel like oh, I don't want to be mean. Uh, well, if, we, I, if we can't show it, then uh, if you search this product on Amazon, there's a there's a product video made by Trisha herself of how to apply it with the worst ASMR I have ever seen in my fucking <laughs> life. It is so, it is wild that this is the how they they list this product. The editors can put it in. Okay, there's a there's a whole baggie of products here. We have Malibu Sunset Night Cream. Okay. We have day cream. Well, it's nighttime here, so I guess I'll put on the night cream. How does this come out? Oh, aggressively. Yes, and it's oh, okay. Really farting its way out. I how do uh apply a nickel-sized amount? That's about a nickel to your face and your eyelids. Is this expired? <laughs> so okay, I think now is the right time to tell you what happened when I ordered this product. So I thought it would be funny. I ordered a single item of this cosmetic line. I ordered the uh, uh, the glow skin enhancement that you would put on an oil at night. It's in a little dropper bottle there. Um, they sent me the entire makeup line. I bought a single item. They sent us everything. <laughs> I don't know. Every time I've been laughing about it, everyone just says, dude, they're unloading their shipments. They're just unloading their product. Yeah, that's kind of alarming. It is. Did we get it for free? We basically made money on this. If it was <laughs> worth any money to begin with. Okay. One of these exploded in here. <laughs> um, okay. Wow. I'm just holding this in my hand. Here we have eye miracle. Do not put that anywhere near your eyes. I guess I'm just going to like Simba this, you know? Okay, um, let's take, oh God, oh, it's, okay. Uh, rip your hair, am I gonna go bald? Oh God, no, you wouldn't do it? Why wouldn't you do it? What's happening? You're gonna have acne? Well, no, 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 something new has to happen. Um, how to use, apply a few drops of the Night Glow Night Renewal Serum in the palm of your hand. Gently rub it over your face. There's so much I put over my face. Pizzafy it? Guys, what is there to pizzafy? Oh, this is cr oh my god. Bro, this is her this is her schizo serum right here. It has to be. This is what gives her her gaslighting powers. Oh my god, taste it. <laughs> 
I don't want any of this on me. I'll put some of this on my hand. Why not? Fuck it. Like, what's it gonna be? What's the worst that could happen? <laughs> okay. Right, let me rub that in. <coughs> Whoa, you're glowing. <gasps> oh, 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 that is potent. We have um, um, a miracle bar with, I want to point this out, with the ingredients and the instructions too small for the human eye to read. I cannot read that. I cannot read that at all. Wet your hands and rub the Miracle Bar Soap. The worst that could happen is you'll get irritated. Um, I guess we can find out if it pizzas. Let's see. Let's, let's test it. Okay, we're gonna do this. We're gonna take this, clean this off, push, scoot all this out. Who do you can get the next one ready? Actually, let me first guess the price. Am I guessing the price of everything? So you're gonna guess the price of what we paid for everything? Which I was... paid for that night serum. So, uh, but they sent us everything. So uh, okay, you have makeup to guess shit what is insanely is. expensive. So, night serum, thirty nine ninety nine. You know, I will say that isn't the worst guess, but this, that bottle that we bought was $32.31. That's, yeah. That's not bad. Okay. I don't mind that at all. Uh, I believe the entire seven piece skincare set that we were sent though is originally priced at $180. We got all of this $180 shit for $32? Yes. That's what's the most alarming thing. That, that's not a good sign that they just sent us this. I know. That's that that tells me a lot. All right, I'm gonna try this now. I'm, uh, I'm gonna get Did the next one ready for you. I'll be ready. Thank you, thank you. I'm just gonna seal this. This is a biohazard, bro. Okay. Uh, also, I, I listen. I don't know anything about skincare shit, but wh here's what I do know. I do know about selling products. And I don't mean I know a lot, but I do know enough to say this. If you buy a $30 product and they send you $150 worth of product, I think the product is absolute shit, dude. They sell the antidote 50% off. Come in. This is awful. I did not like that one at all. And I couldn't eat it. Well, hey, buddy, you know, your skin is looking great. So what else do you need when you're going out in the town? A uh, clothes. Well, how about you, you want to smell good? Oh, dude! Yes! All right. We have um, the, the, the man who maims his friends and covers sexual assault. We have David Dobrik perfume. I, I have wanted to smell this since he released it. I have wanted to... Oh, David's perfume. Amber and cashmere. Ooh, okay. Okay. Um, ooh, okay. That's not... That is not... I haven't sprayed it yet, but right out the gate, this does not smell... Awesome. I love that we're going through vlog squad shit. Oh, we have a video here. David's Perfume by David Dobrik. Let's watch it. Here we go. It's only a minute long. Ooh! Guys, make... Jesus Christ. Let me pull it up first. Come on. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I can have sex with attractive women if I spray this on me. That, easy. Hands in the air, nobody need that was a weirdly thin amount of toothpaste. In the air, I don't know, maybe I'm maybe I put too much. I always thought he was gay. What does that have to do with, what is it? That's a bad pause. What does that have to do with uh, cologne? Where's the cologne at? Yeah, then what is this, what does this mean? Well, you know what he smells like doing all of this now. 
Uh, let me think of it like that and as I watch. No, I get it now. I get it now. It's a vibe, bruh. Damn, he's getting hit. Wow! Intercourse! That could be me! That should... No, that fucking should be me. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, this is a way too long of an ad. This could have been half as long. All right, we get it, David. We get it. I like I I like the cologne I wear. I like a good cologne, and I think a good cologne is I think it's important. I think it is the, the most. It, it it brings an outfit together. It, it it should not dominate a room. It should not you know make people uncomfortable. But a good cologne is good, and it gets in there. Uh, all right, here we. What's on his face? It's you hardening. Can spray it on that paper, if you wanted. Um, no, I gotta spray it on me. I'll spray the oh, first one on the paper. Okay, it's out. It's ready. After you spray it, I'll read some Google review or some okay. Amazon reviews. You as can well. start. You can do that as I as I spray it now. Mm -hmm. uh, this one, uh, Amazon customer, one star. Smells like chemicals. <laughs> <laughs> one star yeah. from Nick Birdsong. Smells off now. From Yasmin, one star. Didn't like. Yeah, that is. Uh, I'm gonna be very honest here that is um that is not good at all wow this one it's, says paint thinner yeah no hold on i'm 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 does it pizza fight we'll find out i'm kind of confused how it smells so bad oh let me spray some more here Terrible. <coughs> you know what it smells like? Oh, it's in my mouth. <coughs> hey, that smells like um, like a like very, very cheap cologne. Like it's it's it's. I'm no nose expert or anything, and I don't even know how to. What's a cologne you like? I only wear two, and I got them from just basic online bullshit i wear that dior sausage one and i wear the million dollar one whatever those two are and i like the way those smell and and the people who matter that that tell me like the way those smell too oh my god it is so dude it's not going away after that second spray oh, my no. god it smells bad i do not like this at all and i gotta speak for the ladies in my life I do not think any ladies would like this either. I that's that's really the reason why we wear cologne, boys. Is if you ever get a if you ever get a little incel hug, you want them coming back for another. That does not smell good at all. I'm gonna pizzafy it real quick just to see if that improves it. I mean, maybe it will. Um, it does not seem to be improving it at all. You're mansplaining. You should actually find a bridge. This um, uh, it doesn't seem to have improved it even slightly. It looks cooler. It actually kind of looks more exciting. Yeah, he tried to. It looks like he tried to do like a higher end looking bottle too. The smell that comes. Oh god, the pizza smell is mixing with this. I'm gonna seal this off in like a coffin now. Um, oh, oh, it, the bottle, the packaging, everything makes it look like it would smell better than it does. It smells cheap. It smells bad. I would not wear it in a pinch. This is how bad it is, chat. In a pinch, if I was going somewhere important and I wanted to wear cologne, my God, I cannot breathe in here. Hold on. Holy fuck. Jesus Christ. In a pinch, if it was my only option, in a pinch, I would just choose to not wear cologne. That's how bad of cologne. Like, I will wear cheap cologne. In the oh, let me borrow your cologne. It's cheap. Whatever. In a pinch, I would never. I would not wear it. Um, Okay, Booty, I'm ready for the next one. All right. I'm going to treat you. I'm going to treat you good this time. Okay, I'll be right. Thank you. Thank you. I'm kind of shocked that someone, because David Dobrik, I feel like he made this at a time when he was on top. I feel like. I'm surprised someone like David Dobrik couldn't come up with a better cologne. I think it definitely screams 
cash grab as opposed to like a dude who cares a lot about sense who did took time did research whatever price oh shit the price i forgot Ask booty I'll, I'll we'll get we'll do it when he comes back god if he's tr i mean <laughs> i wouldn't pay anything for that oh, it's really guys it's really hard to breathe in here booty do you smell it is it smells like a grade school gym locker room it's bad dude is it oh. it's not good right it's so bad this smells like what the cool kids thought it good smells yeah yeah it's like, like axe for kids like yes. they're like this smells sick Whew, it's really bad dude i don't like that i sprayed so much <laughs> i was trying i was maybe seeing if the the, the reviews would stop it but maybe not <laughs> hey so here's a treat for you oh shit i put the, the, a super bowl commercial and then uh, another commercial thank you there as well. thank you okay um i guess the price when he gets back to his his seat Whew. Man, I wish you guys could. That's got to be the newest invention. You guys got to be able to smell from where you are because, my God, it is it is hard to breathe in this room. I, I know eat a lot of cologne. If you spray too much of it, it'll become that potent. But even by the first scent. All right. Up next, we have Mr. Beast Feastables. And I've tried these before. And I got to say, I am. Uh, why is my head turning red? I am. I'm a hater. I am out the gate. I am a I am a Mr. Beast, uh, Feastables hater. Let's What's watch this though. The biggest thing you've ever made. The biggest thing I've ever made. Probably these nuts. When Jimmy told me about these nuts, I knew it was gonna be huge. When Jimmy first Oops. told me about these nuts, I thought he was crazy. I love these nuts. Same. I keep a pair on me at all times. Mm. These nuts taste so good. It's like this amazing peanut butter chocolate flavor. Nut tap. Mm. That's good nuts. You have to try these nuts. Go to feast. Okay. Uh, B Booty, are you there? I am. I, 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 I am getting messages that people are saying that the Trisha Peta stuff has caused chemical burns, so you may want to just wipe it what off. What the fuck? To be safe. What, what do you mean? Uh. <laughs> classic, classic Trisha Paytas moment. Y'all having a fun time, chat? What's been your favorite item so far? Bro, what the fuck is that? Oh, by the way, I could burn your fucking face. Bro, leave it to fucking Trisha Paytas, dude. Are you kidding me? Okay. What, during uh, all my research, I didn't realize I that off. it was that bad. Oh, I sat back headphones. down. Sorry. What's up? Oh, I said during I was researching. I didn't find that. I just heard people saying like overpriced, not worth it, and more comments about like Trisha herself than that. So I I, I apologize if there is like that bad of stuff with it. Okay, uh, that's fine. Also, can I guess the price of the Dobrik? Absolutely, you can. Uh, I'm gonna say forty nine ninety nine. Ooh, Wubby you overshot the mark a little bit. The Davrick Dobrik perfume number one is thirty one dollars and seventy nine cents that's fair it's dog shit i mean it should be less but whatever my <laughs> forehead feels not great uh my hand smells good still all right i have tried the original chocolate bar but we have milk chocolate quinoa crunch which is that's funny these nuts i haven't tried any of these and carl gummies two different flavors all right let's try these uh I'm going to go right out the gate. I've tried the original. When I tried it, when these came out, I did not like it at all. <clears throat> Your forehead looks fucked up. It feels rough right now. <clears throat> all right. Here's the OG. Um, That's not bad. Kind of bitter. Dev uh, kind of bitter. <clears throat> Wait, is that dark chocolate? Okay, kind of bitter. Um, This is the milk chocolate one.
I like the milk chocolate one. <clears throat> I like the milk chocolate one a lot. That's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. That's not bad. Yeah, that's how chocolate works. How do you fuck up chocolate? That's really the question. Uh, these nuts made with peanut butter. Where's the peanut butter? Is this really what they're saying? Peanut butter? Like, hello? There's nothing in there. Whatever. I'll try it. That's not good at all. The D's nuts peanut butter one, not good. Not good at all. That's just worse Reese's. Got him. Yeah, not good. Guys, I will pizza fry it. Relax. All right, here's the quinoa crunch. I guess this is their answer to a, like, a crunch bar. See how it has, like, acne scars on the back? The most goaded of candy bars. No. Not good. I would, um... I don't know why I would ever see a crunch bar on the aisle and that and, and pick that. I would pick the crunch bar every time. Um, all right, Carl Gummies. Um, very low expectations for these. In fact, they look wet in there. These are the sour green apple. Oh, these are gonna taste like shit. Yeah, those are the only two flavors. I think it's the green apple and then there's a blue okay. raspberry. I'm gonna try the blue raz. I'm a little... Hold on. Let me try this, and then I'll say. I kind of like those a lot. <laughs> I kind of like those a lot. Those are pretty good, actually. Those aren't bad, actually. I kind of like those. Friendship maintain. Those are weed gummies. They look, don't they look like weed gummies? This looks like shit you get at the dispensary, bro. Are you kidding me? I know it's not, but like, that looks like dispensary packaging, like straight up. All right, I will pizza fry one of them. Go ahead. I will pizza fry. Bro, the whole appeal on I just broke it. I will pizza fry one of them. The gummies. I will pizza fry any other one of them. The quinoa one. I'll do the gummies. Oh my god. Fine, I'll do the green apple gummy. Oh god. I'm gonna guess the price. What price am I guessing, Booty? For all so of these? I have I have three prices uh together. I have the mini bar of the quinoa. I have mm -hmm. the, the big regular bar and then how much the Carl gummies were per each. So I have three prices for you. I'm going to guess do the big how... bar for the point. Can I guess the big bar for the point? Yeah, absolutely. And this one, I'd say you have to be within 50 cents because it's a candy bar. Two ninety nine for the big bar. All right. You know what? Yeah, I'd say you got that one, but it's uh, two forty eight. Two nah. forty eight. We got that at the old Walmarts. Nah, I would. Who's picking these over like other candy bars? Like, no way. No way, bro. These aren't. I'm sorry, but they're just. I feel like candy has been figured out, you know, by like evil men in suits. I'm sorry. Oh, wait, Children chat's are? saying 51 cents off. I'm sorry. You don't get the point for that one. Booty. It's 51 cents off. Okay, then I'm not eating this fucking green apple pizza. <laughs> oh, oh, wait, you know they what? want I me think to... it counts. The judge, I'm going to the judges. They're wait. saying it was a rounding error. They're, they're voting. They want me to do D's Nuts, uh, which is the group. D's Nuts was not good on its own. They're, okay, I'll do D's Nuts. Fine. They voted in chat. D's Nuts. Uh, pizza Fight. it. Here we go. I don't know why I keep doing this, because I need you guys to understand. Every time it's disgusting. This is for the boys. <laughs> that wasn't bad. <laughs> hey, listen. Listen. I'm I'm not do I'm not putting on any show here. You guys know that was not bad. I do not know why. I have no, I was ready to gag. I don't know why. That kind of Can I Oh, yeah. sorry. Can but, I share a hot take? Yeah. This was something I used to do as a kid in grade school pizza lunch. 
Uh -huh. They would give us like a pizza and a brownie for dessert. I would take the brownie, crumble Stop. it up into little pieces and smash it into the pizza and make a chocolatey pizza. It is so good. I I kind of am on your side that the chocolate and pizza sauce is probably really it, good. It wasn't bad. Compared to everything else, it was, it was pretty good, actually. I'm not going to lie. I, I didn't mind it at all. It did not do. It, it does this throw up thing in my mouth. That one didn't do it at all. Also, this fucking soap is still on my desk. I keep thinking it's a big thing of cheese. So the, the I want to booty while you're bringing in the next product. I'm gonna talk here to chat. Yeah, chat. absolutely. I'll be right back. The the Trisha Paytas shit. I I can't like I don't know if it comes through there. It looks so cheap. This looks printed, and, and I don't mean that in a good way. This looks printed from a computer, like like a printer you would have in your home. It looks so cheap. This makes me sad. It's not I. Man, I'm not surprised Trisha was kind of snake oiling it up. Maybe, allegedly, I don't know. But this is worse than I ever would have thought. Also, I smell pungent. I smell a lot. Hey, how many more do we have left? Uh, so I have the next two here. After this, there's two more. So Jesus Christ, booty! I got you so much. I got everything. Okay, so, let's see. Uh, be careful with this box. This box is what they shipped it in, but it's inside. And then on top is the first thing. They're very self-explanatory, so... Okay, is this wall one product? Or uh, two products, so the, that is okay. one thing, and then when you're done, the bottom is, a, is another one. Come on. All right, we're going to get through these quick now, boys. Sticking with the, the vlog squad... God, my nose is burning. That's probably not good. Oh, I gotta sneeze. <laughs> the mic's gonna fall off? No, it's not. <laughs> okay. We have Jeff Wittick, Jeff's Barbershop. I am, am I, am I a loser for being a fan of Jeff Wittick? Because I like Jeff Wittick. This stuff look, and I've always wanted, you don't know who Jeff Wittick is of Jeff's Barbershop? <laughs> what? You guys don't know who Jeff's Barbershop is? I love, I, I, Jeff's Barbershop is legitimately a funny, uh, channel on YouTube. No, not at all. Really? You, maybe you'd recognize him. Does he have any photos on his website? I'm on his website right now. Oh, here he is. Here he is on the left. There he is. You can see him there on the left. Um, he's hanging out. <laughs> Never heard of it. That's, I, wow. I'm surprised. Y'all are old or young. I don't know which one it is here. Maybe I'm old. He's that guy with the hat. He, <laughs> He's that guy from New York with a hat. He is. Uh, okay. We have the Jeff Barbershop. Uh, uh, I'm assuming this is a mini, a mini bag of um, hair products because that's what he does. He cuts hair. I bet uh, you yeah, this so shit's quality. I really yeah, this do. Was, this was his complete collection. So this was everything that they had to offer. I put it all in the, the bag. Deodorant? Jeff's Barbershop deodorant? Come on. Jeff wouldn't scam me, right? He's the guy that David Dobrik almost killed. Yes. Ooh, okay. Immediately, you guys, what is that material that's like kind of soft plastic? Feels like you could squish it, but you can't. This is, this feels nice. I love the way this feels. God damn, this, look at this deodorant. God damn. It's called rubberized. Yes, yes. Ooh, ooh. Man, I knew Jeff would smell good. I like the way this smells. Ooh, I kind of want to lick it. What's the smell? It smells really fresh. Ugh. I didn't like it. Okay, that's the deodorant. It I love it. I love the packaging. Oh, 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 oh. I'm not gonna pizza fight. Hello? Are we back? I don't want a pizza fight. It's on this bag. Let's see what else we got. We have uh clay pomade. What is that? What is clay pomade? Uh, it's like a like a hairstyling thing. Usually the clay will be not as like shiny in your hair. It'll be like a little more matte finish. It's like a, like a styling stuff. I love it. I'm gonna be honest, and maybe I'm just a Jeff Wittick fanboy. I really, really like his packaging for all this. Feels good in the hand. Rubberized. Looks nice. Looks quality. I don't. I can't speak to the quality of it. Uh, because what do I know about the quality? Bro, even the, I'm sorry, but even the comb looks nice. It's clean. Yeah, so the, it's, uh, that clay pomade too, was sandalwood scented. The deodorant was fresh. It's a medium hold with matte finish. 
it's just this is this is quality i don't know i like it i wonder how much it's gonna be though and the bag is nice i don't know put that in your hair i'll put it in my hair what is this one uh texture spray what do you think that does that gives you a light hold and a textured finish oh okay immediately a little annoyed uh this is a two-part top oh wait oh it's just a pull okay well right out the gate poured half of it into my crotch so that's not good okay that's uh maybe a user error you thought i was gonna snap it uh definitely could definitely could definitely not gonna maybe a skill issue there on my on my part so i, I can only take blame for that i want to put some of this clay in my hair i'm gonna do it fuck it how much do you think you need wow uh, take your take your finger give it a little scoop and then that put it like firm, in the, the 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 ball of your hand and give it a little like friction like rub your hands together you know make some heat get it activated and then and then kind of throw it through your hair That's too much? That was a lot. <laughs> Dude, I think I'm looking pretty good. Whoa. It's so mad and textured. Do I look stylish? Whoa. Is that Jeff Wittick? Who, who am I watching right now? I... Fuck my dirty ass, but I... I think I'm gonna keep this. This, this works. I don't know. I like it. Now I gotta pizza-fy my hair. I don't want to pizza-fy any of these products. I apologize. Um, texture spray. I don't know how I could use that. The deodorant smells fucking good. God, it really does smell good. I'm specific with deodorant, though, because I really need it to stop me from sweating. Um, what is this bundle worth? Okay. Yeah, so you had the you had the shave bag, you had the comb, mm -hmm. you had the clay pomade, you had the matte finish. I mean, I don't know. Uh, the deodorant and the pomade, I think I could guess like what they're worth. I have no clue what texture spray goes for. The comb is probably next to nothing to produce, but it is a cool little thing, and the bag is probably next to nothing. I'm gonna say. I would, I would pay 30 bucks for this. I'd pay 30 bucks. Okay, unfortunately, you ended up paying a little bit more than the 30 for this. All together, all said and done for this complete set uh, is $90. What? Okay, can I tell you though, that does tell me that this is probably quality. I mean, he is, so Jeff Wittick is a, he cuts hair for a living. Well, I guess he does YouTube now, but he cuts hair on his YouTube. And I think, I would assume he's shipping good shit, but I don't know. Someone, someone should, someone should look into that who does hair. He's a podcaster now. It's just a ripoff. You tell me, chat. I'm saying, I don't, my head's getting very itchy. I feel like, especially too, can you check the deodorant? I didn't check how many, how many, how big is the deodorant bot or like the, the container? 2.6 like, ounces. That doesn't seem like a lot. Do you have a deodorant on your desk at all? Like Why how much is a normal thing? I don't know. I don't have mine. I don't see where mine is. Now this is a kind of expensive. I said I would pay 30 bucks for this. I would not, I would not pay that much for this. Um, it better be some baller spray and... Wait, 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 wait. Uh, better be some baller spray and clay product. It is clay. It says right here. Clay pomade. It says. it's. It, I mean, I. but see, that's the thing. I don't know. It says clay pomade and texture spray. I don't know if this is a oh, baller clay pomade. It's like a $50 bundle. I think 50 is probably where I think most people would land on. You said $90? 90 And if nah, after, nah, after taxes... That's, that's, it came with free shipping, but after taxes, it was just shy of a hundred. <sighs> no, that's crazy. All right, let's go to the next one. I'm not looking forward to this. This is ridiculous. <laughs> All right, we have... Who does this? Oh, I see. So this All is right. from... Yeah, this is from uh, a company 
called the Serious Bean Company. Here we have uh, Dude Perfect's Jalapeno Bacon be Pinto Beans. This is fucking stupid. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. This is the dumbest one yet. <laughs> the, who, the, what, Dude Perfect makes beans? Okay. Are we going to, like, are you kidding me? So I thought that Dude Perfect made beans, just like you. They just collaborated with this serious bean co that already existed. I found that out because I bought another flavor of these beans, and it turns out they have nothing to do with Dude Perfect at all. So this is the only flavor that is uh, attached with Dude Perfect. Yeah, Dude Perfect fell off, dude. Oh, I do not. I, wow, I think I realized all at once, I don't like beans. <laughs> Wait, no, it's still bad. It's a bean trick shot. <laughs> Why are they collabing with beans? That's what I'm, dude, that is so, it's like, what do you think of when you think of Dude Perfect? On three, one, two, Pinto beans, right? I mean, like it's, it's, it just comes to the mind. I don't even think Dude Perfect thinks of beans because I'm, I go to their website and it tells you all the companies and products they work with. Do they not mention this one? This one somehow didn't make the cut next to ESPN, the LA Rams, you know, uh, uh, Disney. I, they didn't, Serious Bean didn't make the cut there. I feel like Serious Bean just said these are dude perfect beans. Someone in chat just said it best. That looks ratchet AF. Yeah, kind of agree. So first I'm gonna say this is a $2.99 booty. Can I get a price check? Uh so this I purchased in a six pack from from Amazon. So uh uh if you wanted to guess the the price I paid for six of those bad boys. Okay, well, if they're sold in sixes, why? It's I mean, they taste fine, but a lot of liquid kind of looks like shit. If it's a six pack, I don't know. Eleven ninety nine. I don't know. Just missed the mark, Wubby. Unfortunately, for the six pack, these six cans of beans were seventeen dollars and ninety five cents, just under three dollars <clears throat> a can. That's. I, it's, that's not bad, is it? Is that crazy? Uh, uh, that seems pretty expensive for just a can of beans. Chad, I'm going to be fully that's transparent. I don't eat beans. I've never bought a can of beans in my entire life. That's way too much. Beans are supposed to be very cheap. No, but I mean, they're like, but they're YouTuber beans. <laughs> <laughs> you have to consider they're YouTuber beans. You it's have to consider well trick shotting. I know, I know, Chad, I can understand that beans should be cheap. But these are dude perfect beans that are about to get pizzafied. <laughs> you know what time it is. This one, <laughs> I actually looking forward to this one. Oh, that's disgusting. Yeah, that's gross. The beans on their own taste better. Um. Yeah, whatever. I mean, who gives a shit? This is stupid. This one's kind of funny, but these are. This is stupid. All right, I'm ready for the next product, booty. Oh boy, so am I. So this is, this is the uh, last two? These are the last two. Uh, okay. I'm gonna send you something in uh, here and then I'm gonna bring this product in. So I'll be right back. Okay, thank you. Pizza beans, oh no. Okay, I already see what we got here. Okay. He said first 10 seconds of this, you will need eye bleach. Okay, let's, let's see what the first 10 seconds. Is it? Yeah. So the first Wait, where's where's the other one? Oh, I have one more. Story, oh, oh, okay. But, uh, that's uh, that's uh, yeah. The first ten seconds of this video will ruin everyone. All right, Booty is confident. The first ten seconds of this video will cause issues. <laughs> So whatever that means, we now have in front of me uh, Jeffrey Star Cosmetics L Velour Lip Scrub Diet Root Beer. 
That's right. You're holding in your hands, uh, when you open the box, the Jeffree Star Shane Dawson Collaboration Lip Scrub that is also edible. It's edible? It is edible, I Where believe. does it say that on here? No, where does it say that? It does not say that anywhere on here. <laughs> I believe it's when it's on your lips. It's technically not... It, it won't make you that sick, I think. That's not edible! Why did you say this, Booty? They just want me to pizzafy it now. It's like a it sugar looks, scrub. It, okay, I'm looking at this in camera right now. This looks more appetizing than it is, than it smells. This smells like if root beer was was chemical, like like chemical root beer, like really really chemically. Oh, it tastes good. Wait, should I not be eating it? Yeah, so this product is another one that is no longer available for sale really anywhere, uh, including it is not even listed as ever being a product on Jeffree Star's cosmetic website. Where did you so, find uh, this? I found this bad boy from a third party seller. And you're just letting me comfortably lick it. Well, it was sealed. No, it wasn't. Well, the 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 plastic in the box I had opened, but the 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 thing is real. Right? I, I So I had opened that little black box to make sure that it was the right one, and then I put but, it all back in. So I but did was take the black the box sealed at the time? Uh, yes, I took a, I took the little sticker. I cracked the sticker on it, yeah. We're good. I just wanted so, to make sure, because it didn't mention Shane Dawson anywhere on the outside, so I just wanted to make sure that it, it was the Jeffree Star Shane Dawson see, collab. What do you do? You take this and you... Uh, so uh, I believe for a, a lip scrub, you uh, uh, just kind of, you know, put it on your lips and give it a good scrub. I, I, I was told that uh, your lips leave dead skin flakes, kind of like the rest of your skin, and this lip scrub is a nice little lip exfoliant. I feel like I look whorish. I'm just eating it. Your face is glowing. You smell nice. You, know, you got a new hairdo. Your lips, wow. It kind of tastes like uh, sugar chemicals. Does it make you feel like Jeffree Star or Shane Dawson a little? No, <laughs> not quite. <Good> answer. <laughs> not even close. <laughs> I have nothing in common with. Mm. I'm. Mm. Mm. Let's pizzafy it. So that's a 25k subs for this. Yes, sir. So something that I want to point out now that we're uh, 12 items deep into this <laughs> list. Every single one of these products, the YouTubers on them, their own main page, don't advertise like any of this ever, really. Oh, yeah, yeah. I find that crazy. Like any, like a lot of these products, uh, YouTubers are out here really griming it up. Some of this shit is so obviously a cash grab. This to me screams cash grab. I'm sorry, but this is dog shit. I don't know what this did for my lips at all that a, I'm gonna keep it a buck. What a, what a, what a wet rag in the shower couldn't just do to your lips already. I don't know what this does. I don't get the point of it. It doesn't taste good. It tastes like chemical root beer. I'm really not even sure if I should be eating it or not, um, but I was casually eating it just now. Thank you, Nero, for the five subs. Um, yeah, okay, I'm ready for the next one. Or actually, no, I have to guess the price, right? You have to guess the price. So I did get this from a third-party seller, God, and this is a, a, a no longer available item. Am I guessing the price of the time or the price that you bought it for? Uh, the price that you bought it for, yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Um, fuck, $19.99. Fortunately, Wubby, you're going to have to double that. We had it for $38.92. That is holy <laughs> fucking scam. My stomach's already hurting. Oh no. I need a Carl gummy. <laughs> All right. That's right. Yeah. Robbed. That's insane, dude. And you just ate it. <laughs> you ate like $15 worth. All right. Yeah. I'm not. Is anybody surprised that Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson uh, made a product that is fucking scam. I'm not surprised. Okay, not literally scam. In my opinion, the price isn't worth the 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 thing you get. All right, buddy, I'm ready for the last one. 
All right. So we didn't talk. You My didn't lips tell look me what really your title good. Was gonna be right. What's that? You didn't tell me what you're gonna make the stream title, right? No. I just want. I just. This is not scripted. So I'm gonna bring you the last thing, and we're gonna have some fun with this. I I had a personalized link I wanted to send you. I'll send you a screenshot of what the 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 hyperlink said, and then I'll bring you what's coming. Okay. 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 Oh, is it poop related? Is it poop related? Well, how do we do this one then? So, it, it, I'm... Wait, this is not what I expected at all. How is this poop related? I'll send you the link, but don't open it on stream. What? Okay, this is not what I expected. This is not a Ludwig b-day what is this i okay i i my lips do look my lips look kind of popping oh wait oh i know what this is oh okay okay wow okay 100 do not open on stream this is a video of blippy pooping on a guy from 10 years ago Wow, I see the problem now. So, so Booty, can you give chat a, a crash course in what we're talking about here? Absolutely. So it turns out, I just found this out. I bought this, I bought this toy thinking it was funny, knowing nothing about him. Uh, and then it turns out as I was doing some research that Blippi is apparently canceled because people found a video that he made 10 years ago where he legit poops on another human being as a prank. Now, <laughs> I have the video too still is existing on the internet. You can definitely find it if you're in. Can you link it in here? I'd like to watch it. Uh, yeah, I'm afraid because the thumbnail pops up. So just be oh, extra I, I, careful. Yeah, I, I, yeah, yeah, I got you. Oh my god. Okay. It is. Archived. I wish. I understand. I wish. Is the audio safe? I wouldn't trust it. I, I haven't watched it myself. I saw the thumbnail went, nope, but I'm going to save the link. All right, I'll mute the audio. Oh, oh. oh, no, it's just. All right, I'll describe it. So apparently this guy is in this video. We have a dude sitting on the toilet doing the Harlem Shake, like, build up. He's, he's his, his, excuse me, his pants are down. Okay. It just, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Fucking God! Oh my God! Okay, so it. Oh my God! Oh my God! Why? Hey, it's me, I'm I'm so aware. Okay, so. <laughs> okay, so I need to describe this. When it cuts. The dude is now standing on the toilet with his ass facing away from the tank, crouched down to, as if he were to shit, it would come out and hit the wall. There is another man under him on his neck, legs up, like up like this, legs up, whole taint and asshole showing to the camera with a small sensor bar over it. And then out of nowhere, the dude standing on the toilet just completely diarrhea absolute shit all over the dude on the ground all over the bathroom all everything and the dude on the ground is just taking it i want to clarify the guy pooping is the doll you're holding right now <laughs> <laughs> so what's the story here this guy then became a children's youtuber so, yeah, this was him, like, 10 years before he blew up his blippy, and then people found <laughs> this up, old right. content of his that was, like, shock comedy. But This, this is, is not shock comedy. <laughs> this is, it shocked me. T or, uh, Booty, can you post it on the subreddit? Uh, <laughs> yeah. This was not I'm fun, sorry, T -T. Blippi. This is not fun, dude. Oh, here, I could just show you with the doll what he did. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> I'll show you. Hold on, hold on, look. So, essentially, this is the toilet. I'm looking up the video for reference, okay? 
And he... We know, we know. So he's standing. I gotta bend his little legs. He's standing like this on the toilet. Get, 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 get. Come on, he won't do it. Okay, yeah, he's he's like this. Knees a little more bent. Okay, a lot more bent. Let me see if I can bend him a little bit. Okay, he's not really working with me here, but whatever. He's like this on the toilet, and there's another guy on the ground. Get Addison. You're so right. Oh my God, this is perfect. This is how the dude is on the ground. Okay, and Blippy is up on the toilet like this, okay? And they're just like bobbing, and then to get the pizza, no. <laughs> the, next, the next thing you know, just like this, bobbing at the camera, and then from Blippi, just, I mean, and it is, it is just, it is more than I'm willing to spray right now. Oh, I can't even do it. Open up, motherfucker. I mean, it's just, she covers. And this is pretty accurate, and it's the Harlem Shake video sound. The turd flops on the floor. It's a whole lot of... Well, okay, Booty. Um, so when was this doll made? Uh, this doll was made recently. This is... Uh, this recently? Is a, uh, He's this still is going? A... Well, he has been canceled. I, this is probably about, like, I'd say within a year old or so. I got this uh, uh, from Amazon. Okay. I am going to say... Based on the Addison Ray doll, that this is a nineteen ninety nine dollar doll. Nineteen ninety nine. Wubby, you are five dollars away. Exact. Yes, it is a fourteen ninety nine talking yes, posable action figure. I called it baby. I called it baby. I cannot believe. I mean, this is. I, I'm sorry, Chad, that you now know about this. But <laughs> what? It. I'm sorry. When you make a video like that, like which, by the way, is not funny. It's way too far. I don't get it. It's vile. It's insane. It seems almost deranged. When you make a video like that, you are forever removing yourself from making children's content. Like, that has to... Whoa, 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 whoa. Why are you posting Harlem Shake Poo in, in chat? You can never make children's content ever again. I mean, it's just... It's that simple. You cannot... You need to know better. I'm sorry. Um, okay, Booty, is that everything? That was everything, boss. Thank you, Booty. Give it up for Booty for compiling everything and organizing everything. And thanks for waiting around. This is a long-ass stream today. Yeah, right? That was fun. All right, thank you, Booty. Booty Swagga on God. You can find him on Twitch. Thank you, Booty. Cheers, Cheers. mate. Cheers, homie. Bye. All right, love you, bye, 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 love you, bye. And thank you to Peanut for also finding some of these. Man, I can't believe I watched that video. That video is awful. You guys are all going to go watch it on the subreddit now? All right, that's stream. I will see you guys on Friday. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, have a nice night, everybody. No cases tonight. I'm going to go clean up. Uh, have a nice night. Goodbye. Say bye. Blippi gets the last word. Hey, it's me, Blippi. <laughs> he had diarrhea on another man. Just full-blown diarrhea. <laughs>